sailing, celestial dragons in the chat group author, the chicken is merciful. Chapter 26 The God Killer's Attack, please collect it, thank you. After the time travel began, the three Roys seemed to be asleep and briefly lost consciousness. I don't know how much time passed before my consciousness reconnected. Roy's eyes shot open. Hello, your highness Roy. A beautiful girl with white hair and a well-proportioned figure stood in front of her, greeting her very playfully. The moment he saw her, even though he had experienced countless high-quality women like princesses and princesses, Roy couldn't help but feel a little moved. Obviously, this is Yuakai Hamuki. Just as Yamamoto Gen Ryu Zaiking U said, Yuakai Hamuki, who received the perfect goddess development system from the chat group reward, is most likely to be ranked first in the group in terms of appearance. This traveler in the Shinigami world did not lie, Yuakai Hamuki is indeed beautiful far surpassing every one of her collections. The red-haired girl next to her who was looking at them curiously was obviously Yuakai Hamiki's best friend Yuzumaki Kashina. Look dot 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 why are you looking at me like this? Your Highness Roy. Yuakai Hamiki's pretty face turned red as she seemed a little uncomfortable under Roy's burning eyes. He quickly turned around and looked at the other two people, trying to divert his attention. Senior, sister leader. Her eyes lit up, like a cat seeing a mouse. Yuakai Hamiki rushed towards the two people without hesitation. Roy also took a look. One of them is a beautiful girl with red eyes wearing a JK uniform and stockings. She has majestic legs and voluptuous legs, but does not look fat at all. She is very feminine at a young age and is a complete beauty. The other one is a Chinese-style beauty wearing white hanfu and silk stockings. Her body exudes a sharp aura and is full of heroism. She is like a female general or queen. She is a beauty that is completely different from ordinary women. Surprisingly, it was Kasuma Gokushu and Liu Ohau who traveled to this world with Roy. At this time, Kasuma Gokushu was still a little dazed and had not fully recovered from the discomfort of traveling across the world. Liu Ohau was not affected at all and caught a glimpse of the beautiful white-haired girl rushing toward him. Liu Ohau frowned slightly. She has never been in love, so she really doesn't care much whether her partner is a boy or a girl. But she knew that she would never accept a slut like Yukai Hamuki. She only recognizes the strong, or the other party must at least have the heart of a strong person to climb to the top. 12 Divine Palms of Flying Phoenix Middle. Thousand Jin Phoenix. He had no intention of being merciful to the group members due to the rules of the chat group, or it could be said that Liu Ohao was not a merciful person to begin with. The palm containing the majestic power of the curse is the embodiment of the word martial, and it is the ultimate product of all mental and physical skills reaching their limits. This palm even distorted the air, and with an astonishing force similar to the pressure of a mountain, it struck hard at Yuakai Hamiki who was rushing towards her. If this shot were true, Yuakai Hamiki, a ninja with high attack and low defense, would probably die on the spot, and then rely on Sharingans and Agi to be resurrected and lose one eye. But as the protagonist of the system stream, even though Yuakai Hamiki has always said that she is a waste who doesn't like to work hard, she is still not a weakling who can be ravaged by others. Suzu, facing Liu Ohao's shocking palm, Yuakai Hamiki subconsciously activated her main Kyo Sharingan. Instantly, pale white skeletons emerged from around her protecting her whole body like armor. A huge white bone arm like a giant corpse swung out from behind her at high speed and slapped Liu Ohao fiercely. Roy silently opened the chat group live broadcast. Not knowing what was going on, everyone in the chat group entered immediately and saw two people fighting. Boom! Suzu's huge bone arm collided with Liu Ohao's palm, causing an earth-shattering explosion. The ground trembled violently as if there was an earthquake, and dense and terrifying cracks began to appear on the ground. Crack! There was a crisp cracking sound and Suzu's bone arm was smashed into pieces by Liu Ohao's palm. Yuakai Hamiki's pretty face turned pale. Eight inner gates formation middle dot third middle dot Sheng gate. Open. Buzz. The majestic chakra emerged from Yuakai Hamiki's body, condensing the Suzu armor around her even stronger, as if it were substance. But as Liu Ohao's unabated palm smacked down, there was another crisp cracking sound. Boom. Under the protection of the broken Suzu, Yuakai Hamiki turned into a meteor and smashed backwards knocking down hundreds of towering trees along the way and leaving traces of sonic boom clouds in the sky. Yamamoto? Didn't you just travel through time? Why did you start fighting? The ones fighting were Yuakaiha Slut and Master Liu Ohao. Tasuka Sura, it's scary. Sister Liu Ohao is so strong, asks, it is indeed very strong. Is this the god killer? I really want to fight with such an existence with all my strength. It will be very pleasant to think about it, asks. But doesn't the chat group prohibit group members from hurting each other? Will violators be kicked out of the chat group? Yamamoto, it's just forbidden to kill each other. That Yuakai idiot is also a system flow traveler after all, so she won't die so easily. Yamamoto, I just don't know how she offended Master Liu Ohao. Well, it's probably because of her bad character. Even if they are both women, it is no different from sexual harassment. Dot. After Yamamoto's explanation, Several people in the chat group felt relieved. Tasakasura has a very good impression of Liu Ohao as a big sister, so naturally she doesn't want her to be kicked out of the group just like that. 
podcasts is interested in the powerful beings such as the God Killer and the God of Disobedience in the world of God Killer, and does not want to lose such an interesting world. Dot. And in the Hokage world, Miki seeing Yuikai Hamiki being knocked away by that terrifyingly powerful beautiful woman just after they met her, Yuzu Maki Kashina was suddenly shocked and angry. She never expected that the mysterious friends Yukai Hamiki said she would bring her to meet would suddenly launch an attack. Arsal. Without any hesitation, the violent chakra energy emerged from Yuzu Maki Kashina's body. That is the chakra belonging to the Nine Tails Tailed Beast. But someone was faster than her. Sorry, Kashina. This is just a joke between friends. I can't let you disturb the two of them. The man's gentle voice sounded next to his ears, and he patted Kashina's neck lightly with his palm. Snapped. Kashina's vision went dark. She lost consciousness, and she collapsed in Roy's arms. Before she lost consciousness, her mind was filled with one thought. Is this terrifying move a joke? You think I'm an idiot? Question mark. On the side, Kasuma Gokushu was already frightened. Are these people monsters? Although I have seen the battle scenes of various strong men from the live broadcast of the chat group, I know that these people are terrifying strong men who can break mountains and rocks at will. But after experiencing it live, I realized that this was simply a natural disaster. The shock and fear it brought were definitely unmatched by watching the live broadcast. The shock of the earth just now made her whole body tremble uncontrollably, and she couldn't even stand steady. The aftermath of the battle almost affected her. Thinking of this, Kasuma Gokusha raised his frightened eyes and looked at the figure blocking him. It was a tall man with a height of over two meters and a very handsome appearance. He seemed to be a completely different species from the men in her own world. If this Mr. Tan Long hadn't stood in front of him, he would have been seriously injured even if he hadn't been killed by the aftermath of the battle, right? Feeling his heart pounding, even though he knew that this was the so-called suspension bridge effect, he only felt fond of Roy after being saved by him. But dot 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 it's really reliable and exciting. As a light novel writer, Kasuma Gokushiu is undoubtedly very emotional. Therefore, in the original work, and Yilun also supported her creation as an avid reader and helped her vigorously promote her work. She will be moved and obsessed by it, and even if she is suspected of being used by the other party to work for her, she will not care too much. Now facing Roy, the same is true. Kasuma Gokushiu seems to be arrogant and venomous, but her heart is very soft and she is easily moved. Chapter 27 The loser will leave a mark on himself. If it were Kasuma Gokushiu who had been in the chat group before, a hero saving the beauty would probably be able to gain her a very high initial favorability. However, she has already seen her memory copy in the chat group. Today's Kasuma Gokushu is much more mature than before, so naturally it is impossible for her to be tempted by others easily. So she quickly adjusted her emotions and said to Roy very politely, Thank you for saving me, Mr. World Noble. You're welcome, it's just a small matter. After all, we are friends. Accepting Kasuma Gokushu's thanks calmly, Roy just glanced at her and then turned his attention to the two people in the ruins of the battlefield in the distance. For some reason, Kasuma Gokushu suddenly felt a little unhappy. Is it because he is weak that this worldly noble gentleman quickly looks away from himself? However, this is actually normal. Looking at the back of Liu Oho standing on the ground like a Valkyrie not far away. Even though they are both women, Kasuma Gokushu has to admit that the other person is much more attractive than herself, and her attraction to men is even more fatal. Dot. Ugh, it hurts so much, sister leader. If you want to fight, can't you just remind me to get ready? While complaining, Yuakai Hamiki, whose clothes were in tatters and with many scars on her fair skin, walked out of the pile of rubble. She was not angry because Liu Ohao took action against her. After all, Liu Ohao was a well-deserved tyrant in the world of God Killers. Just seeing her appearance will ruin your eyes. Liu Ohao is such an unreasonable existence. In some respects, perhaps even the Tanlong people are not as bad as Liu Ohao. Therefore, Yuakai Hamiki was already prepared. As a female licker, if she wants to win Liu Ohao's favor, fighting with him and experiencing violent beatings is the only way to go. Unless she is not interested in Liu Ohao. As for Yuakai Hamiki's complaint, Liu Oha didn't pay attention, but smiled lightly and said, Little girl, the enemy will not notify you in advance of the attack. You are really too lazy. After speaking, Liu Oha put down his outstretched arm, relaxed his posture, and transformed back into the Chinese-style beauty-wearing Hanfu. There is no need to continue fighting. Although it was just a palm, she had already tested the limits of Yuakai Hamuki. Strong, but not strong enough to have a good fight with himself. But as a system flow traverser, her future is destined to be bright, and the future is promising. Hey. That's because you are a beautiful big sister, so I don't have any defenses. I won't do this to those stinky men. Yuakai Hamiki murmured in a low voice, rolled her eyes, and an evil smile appeared on her beautiful face. Sister leader, you can't just test me, can you? There is another one over there. Huh? Seeing the beautiful red-haired girl slumped in Roy's arms, Yuakai Hamiki's face suddenly darkened. Your Highness Roy, what are you doing to my future wife? I didn't do anything. Holding Yuzumaki Kashina's hands tightly, Roy said with a smile, by the way. 
Your future wife's body is so soft and warm. Liuoha, Tasuka Sura, Yamamoto Genri Uzai Karuha, Ala, behind Roy, Kasuma Gokushu added in a timely manner, it was like being bullied on the spot. Hateful. Yuakai Miki was extremely sad and looked at Liuoha with tearful eyes, sister, leader. You have to make the decision for me. My wife has been snatched away. The corner of Liu Ohao's mouth twitched slightly, but he had no intention of paying attention to this idiot. But she still turned around and looked at Roy, who was standing in front of Kasuma Gokushu. TSK, stay away. Roy glared at Yuakai Hamuki, who was not far away and started to gloat, and said in a gentle tone, Take Yuzu Maki Kashina to that Yuakai idiot, she can protect you. Um, Kasuma Gokushu nodded vigorously his face very solemn. Of course she knew what was going to happen next. God Slayer vs Celestial Dragon. If nothing else, these two are most likely the two most powerful in the chat group today. And the battle scene between these two people was definitely more shocking and terrifying than the one just now. It was naturally impossible for Roy to put as much effort into protecting himself as he did just now. But before going to Yuakai Hamuki, Kasuma Gokushu couldn't help but turn her head and glance at Roy. Must be careful. Kasuma Gokushu said to Roy with a solemn expression, if you die accidentally, leader Liu Oha will also be kicked out of the group. Roy, Tasuka Sura, Yamamoto, huh? It's been a long time since I watched anime. Is Kasuma Gokushu originally at Tsundia? No, this is obviously a combination of poisonous tongue and Tsundia. Apostrophe. Roy complained in his mind. Yuakai Hamuki, who was obviously present at the scene, also spoke in the group. Ah ah, Shiba Senpai is caring about his highness Roy. Yuakai Hamuki, why don't you care about me? I'm obviously cuter, and I was just injured. Seeing that her favorite character was actually caring about Roy, the only man in the chat group, Yuakai Hamuki immediately clutched her chest in grief. It hurts, it hurts so much. The slap Liu Oha gave him didn't hurt so much. Senpai, and then Kashino again. This is simply double the number of cows. If Roy hadn't joined the chat group, Senior Sha would definitely come and care about me. No. There's still a chance. I must capture the senior sister before his highness Roy. Or I must join in and share with my senior. Holding an unknown fantasy, Yuakai Hamiki was resurrected with full blood. He took the unconscious Kashina from Kasuma Gokushiha's hands, then moved away from Roy and the two, and placed several defensive ninjutsu barriers on the ground. Does it need to be so exaggerated? Looking at the busy Yuakai Hamiki, Kasuma Gokushiha couldn't help but ask. Yuakai Hamiki looked serious, of course. The next step is the mythical battle. Dot. This is truly a well-deserved mythical battle. Standing not far from Roy, Liu Ha, who was wearing white hanfu, sighed softly. You have the hand of Hermes and various powerful treasures, and I am the god killer who robs the power of the disobedient god. The battle between you and me is nothing less than a battle between myths and myths. Let me ask, why are we fighting? Roy looked at Liu Ha curiously and asked. Liu Ha was stunned for a moment, and then couldn't help laughing. Do you still need a reason to fight? I am the god killer and the demon king. I am born with a desire to fight and plunder. All strong men are my prey. Fighting maniac. I understand. After gently flexing his stiff wrist, Roy continued to ask, then before the battle begins, can I make a request? Oh? Liu Ohao was stunned for a moment, then nodded and said, just tell me. Since I'm your prey, there's no need to be polite. Roy grinned evilly and said his purpose. The winner wants to leave his own mark on the loser. How about that? Mark? Dot 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 I understand. He really has the temperament of a puppy. During this time in the chat group, I also learned some things about the Tanlong people in the pirate world, but Liu Ohao was not angry, but had a helpless smile on his face. From the perspective of others, this kind of thing is actually quite insulting. But in Liu Ohao's view, Roy is like a puppy. When he sees something he likes, he wants to bite it hard and leave his own mark. He is never satisfied. This is a reflection of his immaturity and what makes him cute. Considering that Roy is probably less than 30 years old including his past and present lives. He is still a child in her eyes, which is understandable. Anyway, as a god slayer and a demon king, there was no way she could lose. Even if something unexpected happens and she really loses, it doesn't matter. Having Roy's mark on her body will not make her feel humiliated, nor will it affect her glory as a god slayer and demon king. Even if her body is broken into pieces, she is still the only god slayer in the world. Liu Ha, Chapter 28 The Battle of Myths, please collect. P.S. The previous chapter was banned and will probably be released soon. Dot. Let the mythical battle begin. Celestial dragons of Otherworld. Liu Oha gave a soft drink, and mysterious words emerged from his mouth. Fight in the south of the city, die in the north of Go, die in the wild without being buried as a crow, but you can eat it. Call the crow for me, and be a guest. Powerful Vajra magical power dash! Exclamation mark. As the spirit of words fell, golden particles emerged on its surface, eventually transforming into two majestic Vajra warriors that were 20 meters tall. Judging from its appearance, 
This move looks a bit like the wooden gilam jutsu from Senju Hashirama in the Hokage world. But this is actually the power that Liu Ohao usurped by defeating the two Buddhist benevolent kings Vajra of Secrets and King Narayana. It is a well-deserved power of God. With this power alone, Liu Ohao possesses both ultimate attack and ultimate defense. It can break mountains and mountains at will. And it can also block the magic sword that cuts off all things. The first shot is to test your strength and speed. The spell power in his body surged like the ocean, and the two Vajra warriors behind Liu Ohao appeared in front of Roy out of thin air as if teleporting, waving their huge golden palms at the same time. Shuchi method and divine foot power. This is not the power obtained by killing gods, but the technique mastered by Liu Ohao himself. It is the true sense of instant movement, and the ultimate speed. And those two Vajra warriors used her famous stunts. The twelve divine palms of Fei Ifing middle dot danfing Oyang. Wow, the power of the spell turned into scorching sun flames, igniting the surrounding forest. The two Vajra warriors, one on the left and one on the right, trample the earth while using Liu Ohao's best martial arts. Can't escape. Faced with this flanking attack, Roy realized this in an instant. Liu Ohao represents the ultimate in martial arts. He is a warrior who has reached the peak of his mental and physical skills. His combat experience has completely overwhelmed him, a pampered Tan Long. The opponent had completely blocked his retreat when he took action. Even if he was faster, it would be of no avail. So, without any hesitation, Roy released the true name of his noble phantasm. The Belt of Hercules. World Destroyer Bindy Wald once used the power of the Momo fruit to crush the giant kingdom in terms of strength and speed. This treasure is the fantasy sublimation of this legend, giving Roy the speed and speed to absolutely crush his opponent's strength. It can even be said that in a one-on-one -on -one situation, as long as this noble phantasm is released, Roy will be invincible. Block it for me. Instantly gaining the speed and strength to crush the Vajra warrior, Roy stretched out his arms like lightning and grabbed forward. Boom. The deafening loud noise made everyone in the chat group feel deaf even though they were countless worlds apart. Not far away, Yuakai Hamiki's expression changed drastically. Without hesitation, she picked up Kasuma Gokushiu and rushed further back at high speed. In the very center of the battle between the two sides, all the existence of woods, rocks, and earth within tens of kilometers were wiped out in an instant. What? A cry of surprise came from the center of the battlefield. Roy saw the huge sunflame palms of the two Vajra warriors being grasped in his hands. It seemed that he had gained the advantage of the first move. In the eyes of everyone in the chat group, this is indeed the case. Although the two Vajra warriors are 20 meters tall, Roy is only over 2 meters tall. There is a huge size difference between the two. But even so, the arms of the two giants were still grabbed by Roy and unable to move. Even because Roy's power crushed the Vajra warriors, dense cracks appeared on the arms of the two Vajra warriors. These injuries were also reflected on Liu Ohao, and blood was dripping from her arms. Obviously, even Liu Ohao, as a god slayer, still could not break through the rules of Roy's noble phantasm and was completely crushed in terms of strength and speed. However, the reality is that the exclamation just now belonged to Roy. Just because Liu Ohao activated his second power almost seamlessly, the sky is clear. The earth is peaceful, and the human world is peaceful. The great technique of dragon roaring and tiger roaring. Buzz. A strange demonic wind emerged from the Vajra warrior, and in the form of a shock wave, it crashed into Roy, who was clutching his arm in front of him. This is the power that Liu Ohao usurped by defeating the him god Iskayatri in Indian mythology. This power, Liu Ohao, is usually used in the form of poetry and chanting. The longer the chanting time, the more amazing the power. But even a short chant can summon magical winds and shock waves that are enough to blow away a divine beast. Realizing that in the battle with Roy, his speed and strength would be suppressed because of the Hercules belt, Liu Ohao could only chant a short poem at the moment when Roy attacked. But even so, with the blessing of the powerful Vajra divine art, the demonic wind summoned by this short poem is enough to level a hill. Mr. World Noble Kasuma Gokushiu, who was taken to a safe place in the distance by Yuakai Hamuki, was watching the live broadcast in the chat group and subconsciously clenched her slender palms. The other members of the crowd were also staring at the live broadcast, looking forward to how Roy would respond to the combo skills of the leader Liu Ohao. Knowing that I would be suppressed in terms of strength and speed, the Vajra warriors summoned by their powerful Vajra magic technique were just a bit to get closer to me is the subsequent dragon roar and tiger roar technique. The real attack deep in his heart, he sighed at the rich combat experience of Liu Ohao, the god killer. It was obviously the first time that the two of them met, but the other party had already figured out how to deal with his own noble phantom. He even risked his arms being crushed and fractured to complete the blow. There is no doubt that Liu Ohao is betting that Roy is only good at defense and does not have an equally powerful defensive weapon. And this is also a fact. Roy at this stage is indeed better at defense, but very weak at defense. But dot 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 you must have made a mistake. Master Liu Ohao, people in the pirate world are all blood cows, 
and the last thing they are afraid of is to exchange injuries for injuries. With a cold look in his eyes, Roy's body surged with divine power. He exerted force with his arms and threw the two Vajra warriors caught by him into the distance, while also chanting the liberation name of the second noble phantasm in his mouth. God's avoidance. Zheng. The golden sword light was like a meteor, slashing out of Roy's hand at high speed. This is a sure hit that ignores time, space, defense and dodge. It is a well-deserved slash that even gods cannot avoid. Boom. The demonic wind which had been weakened countless times due to insufficient chanting time, but was still astonishingly powerful, crushed Roy hard. Well, blood spurted out of Roy's mouth, and he clearly felt that two of his ribs were broken, and his whole body flew far away as if he had been hit by a truck. At the same time, Liu Hao was also hit by Roy's divine avoidance. Even if she subconsciously condensed the powerful Vajra divine art into armor to protect herself, it was still useless in front of the divine avoidance. Laugh, a penetrating sword wound cut from Liu Hao's shoulder to her waist almost cutting her whole body in half. The blood sprayed outwards like it was free, dyeing the ground red in the blink of an eye. Liu oh how himself even lost control of the two Vajra warriors all of a sudden due to the excessive loss of mantra power and excessive blood loss. Asts, both sides will suffer? Yamamoto Genryu Zaikaruha, no, it's not over yet. These two are not the type who will lose their fighting ability if they are injured. That's right, this battle is not over yet. Take advantage of her illness and kill her. Knowing that given Liu oh how's character, Showing mercy to her in battle would be an insult, Roy had no intention of holding back, raising his hand to wipe the blood from the corner of his mouth, and ignoring Liu Ohao who had quickly regained his fighting power in the distance, Roy shouted sternly, the god slayer who has existed for more than 200 years but is still in his prime, let you see the power of the passage of time, and then surrender and worship under this great power, I am the master of life and death, Roy's third noble phantasm. Liberation. Chapter 29 BW Oh How. Please collect. The so-called inherent barrier is to replace the real world with the mental scene. It can also be understood as an independent other world that belongs exclusively to the caster. It is a great miracle that countless magicians have spent their entire lives but have never been able to achieve. There once was such a man. He was obviously extremely powerful, but he lived alone all his life. He longed for immortality and feared aging and death but he couldn't get it. I am the master of life and death is the perfect reflection of the sad scenery of Lou Fred Redfield's life. Wow. The fantasy heart scenery replaces the real world. The originally crumbling ruins turned into a desolate place full of loneliness and death, because it is an inherent barrier that can only capture one person at most. Only Roy and Liu Ohau entered here, but Kasuma Gokushu, Yuikai Hamiki and others outside can still see what is happening inside through the live broadcast of the chat group. Yuikai Hamiki. Is this the noble phantasm that His Highness Roy obtained by killing Redfield before? The inherent barrier. It is a very rare ability even in the moon world. Yamamoto, Master Liu Hao is in danger. Her injury was already more serious, and now she has been dragged into Mr. Roy's home field. It is simply adding insult to injury. Asts, HMPH, is it most likely that the god killer will be defeated in the end? It's quite expected. Tasuka Sigura, you dot 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 look at Sister Liu Hao's face. Kasuma Gokushu, she looks older. Dot. In the live broadcast of the chat group, all group members saw Liu Ohao's appearance at this time. Although his figure was still upright, even though his whole body was stained red with blood, he did not look embarrassed at all. But her skin, which was originally as porcelain white as a 28-year-old girl, was now as wrinkled as that of an 80-year-old woman, and her silky black hair was now covered with silver threads. This is just a change in appearance. Kasuma Gokushu and others could not sense it, but Yamamoto Genryu Zaikinu and other powerful people could clearly detect Liu Ohao's strange life breath. If we say that before entering this inherent barrier, Liu Ha, who was seriously injured by Roy using divine avoidance, still had the life breath like the scorching sun. Now, her injuries were obviously better than before, but her life breath at this time was like a candle in the wind, as if it would be extinguished at any time. Yuakai Hamuki, what a terrifying noble phantasm. Yuakai Hamuki, the leader's sister has lived as a god slayer for more than 200 years, and time has not left the slightest trace on her body, but now, Yuakai Hamuki, at Nairona Middle. Roy Saint, please, Your Highness Roy, no matter how you bully me, please don't use this noble phantasm on me. Kasuma Gokushu, me too. Yamamoto Genryu Zaikaruha, me too. Asts colon dot 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 okay, me too. Obviously, even Asts, who has a violent and unpredictable personality and loves torture, has a heartfelt resistance to aging. From this point of view, Roy's noble phantasm may have special attack on women. Dot. Is this I am the Lord who controls life and death? There is no way to avoid it, no way to look back, it seems that more than 90% of the life energy has really been lost. It is really an unreasonable treasure, cough, cough. In the inherent barrier, the old Liu Oh house sighed softly. But compared to how energetic she was before, now she has a little trouble even speaking. The strange thing is that Roy doesn't think she is ugly in this state, 
but has a strange sense of beauty. Is this the so-called beauty that time never fails? Cutting off the appearance of a certain unique XP in his heart, Roy slowly raised his left hand covered with black and gold divine patterns. Let's continue. God Slayer, Roy shouted sternly, if you can't bear it, it's better to beg for mercy as soon as possible. Begging for mercy is not what a king should do. Holding back the severe pain in various joints caused by his body being almost cut off and aging, Liu Ohao forced a crazy smile on his face. It is precisely because the god killer has challenged the impossible that he can kill the god as a mortal. You is your weak physical strength enough to support you in releasing your noble phantasm and continuing to fight? Boy Roy. As soon as he finished speaking, Liu Ohao's figure disappeared from Roy's sight. Shuchi method and divine foot power. Even though his body is old and decaying, Liu Ohao, who has already reached the ultimate level of martial arts, can still show his martial arts. However, the power of Roy, who possesses the noble phantasm, is unreasonable. Even Liu Ohao, who was at her peak before, could not suppress Roy in terms of speed and strength. She could only use a strategy to exchange injuries for injuries, especially now. Feeling the hot spell like sunfire coming from behind, with the blessing of Hercules' belt, Roy turned around faster than Liu Ohao, and then punched out. Boom. This is the sound of fists colliding with flesh. Without any fancy skills, Roy's punch with the blessing of the noble phantasm hit Liu Ohao's soft abdomen hard. Wow. After receiving this heavy blow, Liu Ohao's whole body bent into a shrimp shape in midair and his bloodshot eyes almost protruded from the sockets. A large amount of blood spurted out from the penetrating wound and mouth that had begun to heal. It's not over yet. God killer. With the blessing of the noble phantasm, Roy, who had the absolute speed to crush Liu Ohao, grabbed Liu Ohao's slender wrist in the air with his right hand, then transformed into a fist with his left hand as the hand of Hermes, and blasted out like a violent storm. Bang, 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 bang. Blood surged and the bones in Liu Ohao's body were shattered inch by inch under Roy's terrifying punch. The arm held tightly by Roy had been dislocated long ago, and his whole body seemed to be beaten into a puddle of flesh. At last, after throwing an unknown number of punches, Roy slammed Liu Ohao to the ground with his right arm. Boom! The entire inherent barrier ground shook, and Liu Ohao collapsed in the ruins of the deep pit, completely losing consciousness. Even though her willpower is definitely one of the best among many god killers, what Liu Ohao endured just now was far beyond her limit. It was only then that everyone in the chat group finally realized what a shocking thing had just happened. Sura Tasuka, Liu Oh, Sister Liu Ohao won't be beaten to death by Brother Roy, right? Yuakai Hamuki. Probably not. I have good eyesight. I just saw that she was still breathing weakly. Yuakai Hamuki, but... Wow, your highness, Roy, are you too harsh? Is this necessary? The leader sister is my favorite beauty in Hanfu. Yamamoto Genri Yuzai King U, it is indeed tragic. But this cannot be blamed on Mr. Roy. Because if it was Mr. Roy who lost, I think with the character of the leader Liu Ohao, she would not be merciful at all. Yuakai Hamuki. Dot 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 that seems right. Just like in the original work, her disciples were all psychologically perverted. Asts, that's right. This is just a normal fight. Rather, it's because Roy showed no mercy that I appreciate and am more satisfied with him. Asts. Besides, although I don't know much about this god killer. I have a general understanding of her character from what you said in the original work. I think that rather than being insulted by the enemy, she is more eager to be treated mercilessly. He was completely defeated with ruthless means, right? Chapter 30 Masochist? Well, Liu Oha, who was covered in bandages and treatment drugs, slowly opened his eyes. His beautiful eyes full of confusion. But just for a moment, it returned to its original coldness. I lost. Recalling his miserable appearance while fighting Roy, Liu Oha's face flashed with a trace of unwillingness and then quickly turned into satisfaction and deep joy. Just like what Asts analyzed in the group. If Roy spared him mercilessly during the battle, instead of being happy, Liu Hao would only feel insulted. Instead, after being beaten severely by Roy, she now felt extremely satisfied and very happy. But dot 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 hiss, this kid is really ruthless, and he leaves me powerless to fight back. He is really unreasonably powerful, feeling the large number of broken bones in her body. If the god killer's recovery power was not strong enough, she would have needed at least several months to recover from her injuries. Fortunately, the magic power lost in the battle has been restored, and she has returned to normal from the aging state caused by the noble phantasm. It will take only a few days to recover. Huh? Miss Liu Ohao, are you awake? At this moment, a beautiful girl with red hair appeared at the door of the tent and looked at her in surprise. You know me? Liu Ohao looked at the strange girl in front of him curiously. She sensed a violent energy fluctuation from the opponent's body, which was at least on the level of the weaker god of disobedience. Well. Miki said you are guests from Otherworld, just like the summoning beasts from Mount Myoboku. The red-haired girl smiled and said, By the way, my name is Yuzu Maki Kashina, and I am currently the Jonin of Konoa Village. Um dot 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 hello. As she tried to get off the ground, Liu Oha groaned in pain. She didn't know if it was because she was too seriously injured, but her temper was obviously much better. Hey, you are a patient now, so be careful. Seeing that Liu Oha was about to move, 
Yuzu Makikashina immediately stepped forward and held her arm. Let me help you. Muki and your friends are eating out. Well dot 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 thank you. Knowing that his physical condition was still in poor condition at this time, Liu Ohao naturally would not refuse Gashina's help. So soft. Helping Liu Ohao to walk out of the tent, Yuzu Maki Gashina sighed in her heart. The thought of having such a soft body shattered Miki's extremely hard Suzu with one blow. At the same time, she was still fighting with Mr. Roy. The aftermath of the battle destroyed an entire forest and even completely shattered the earth. She felt very incredible. Well. She no longer blames Miss Liu Oha. After all, she had already seen the result of the battle between Liu Oha and Roy, and she had also seen Liu Oha's broken body that was almost cut in half, with all his bones almost broken. At that time, she almost thought Liu Oha had been beaten to death. Therefore, she completely believed Roy's statement. Liu Oha and Muki were indeed just joking between friends, and the real battle with Roy was real. Outside the tent, Roy and others are eating. The food we eat is naturally some specialties from the Hokage world. Even though these specialties are not delicious, Everyone is still happy to eat them. After all, these are other world's things and are rare things. Rare things are more valuable. Sister, leader, are you awake? Seeing Liu Ohao coming with Kashina's support, Yuakai Hamiki, who was currently attentive to Shiu Kasuma Goka, her eyes lit up and she quickly rushed over to take over, hugging the two of them one on the left and the other on the right. Muki, Yuzu Maki Kashina looked helpless and doting. Liu Ohao, who was in an injured state, no longer resisted as before and sat down at the table with the help of Yuakai Hamuki. I lost. Taking the food handed to him by Yuakai Hamuki, Liu Ohao looked at Roy elegantly and asked, What mark do you want to leave on me? Is it the hoof of the sky-soaring dragon they said in the group? At this point after waking up, Liu Ohao glanced at the messages in the chat group and learned that he had been unconscious for a whole day. On this day, there were a total of several tropics discussed in the chat group. 1. How will Roy and his team complete the mission? 2. Will Roy get a new noble phantasm in the Hokage world? 3. What kind of mark Roy will leave on Liu Oha? 4. Two time travelers, Yuakai Hamiki and Yamamoto, have popularized some important information about the Hokage world. Well, most of it has to do with Roy anyway. Unknowingly, Roy has become the one that attracts the most attention among this sister group. Naturally, Liu Oha saw an existence named Tanxian Dragon's Hoof from the chat history. The imprint left by the celestial dragons on their personal slaves in the pirate world is not difficult to accept. Apostrophe. Liu Oha sighed in his heart. As a loser, she can bear any fate, let alone a mere slave brand. This does not affect her status as the only god killer in heaven and earth at all, nor does it affect her arrogant character at all, nor does it affect her crazy nature that longs for battle. But Roy shook his head, it's not the hoof of the sky soaring dragon, and I had already made that mark on you while you were sleeping. Um, Roy frowned slightly and felt his body, but couldn't find the mark Roy mentioned. After all, her whole body hurts now, who knows where Roy did it. The three girls, Yuakai Hamiki. Kasuma Gokushiu and even Yuzu Yumaki Kashina, were also looking at Liu Ohao curiously from the corner of their eyes, hoping to find any clues. Curiosity is human nature, especially when it comes to something as embarrassing as a man leaving a mark on a woman. Naturally, it deserves 8 trigrams. Roy didn't show off, raised his finger and pointed at Liu Ohao's upper body. This is it. Wow, not caring about the injury at all. Liu Ohao directly pulled off the bandage with medicine. Then I saw that someone had indeed carved two words exuding divine power on the sword. Roy, this is a gift from me, and it can also be regarded as a punishment for your failure in challenging me. Roy chuckled slowly, I want you to lower your head at any time and see my name. You will not be allowed to erase these two words until one day you can defeat me. R? Is this dot 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 is this a confession, or is it an insult? I don't understand dot 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 but why do I think it looks like a token of love? Kasuma Goka Shihu and the girls looked at each other, feeling that they really couldn't understand the brain circuits of the big guys, and Yuzumaki Kashina even blushed with embarrassment. Is this punishment, or something else? In fact, even Roy himself couldn't tell clearly. On the contrary, Liu Ohao himself instead of being angry, was very satisfied with these two words. Yes, I quite like it, and it is very memorable. Well, you like it? Roy's face looked a little strange. After beating Liu Ohao cruelly and doing such an outrageous thing to her, why did it feel like Liu Ohao's attitude towards me was getting better? Is this what makes the God Slayer Queen special? Chapter 31 Kasuma Gokushi's time stops, please collect it, thank you. After eating and drinking, Everyone started chatting. Yuzu Maki Kashina is the most active one. The girl trusted Yuakai Hamiki's words and was very curious about Roy and other people from other world. In fact, if you think about it carefully, the Hokage world already has aliens, Shinigami, androids, and it can even summon the dead to fight. What's the big deal if there are a few other worlders in this kind of world? Strictly speaking, the Otsutsuki clan are also considered aliens. As we chatted, the topic turned to the customs and customs of various other worlds, 
and finally return to the ability itself. After all, most of the people present are powerful people with special abilities, so there is really no shortage of tropics to talk about. Speaking of which, there is something strange. Nine Tails has become very quiet since I met you. Yuzu Maki Kashina curiously held her belly, where the strongest tailed beast in the Hokage world, Nine Tails, was sealed. Little did the girl know that Nine Tails in the seal heard her words and rolled his eyes. Does she dare to make a scene? Not to mention that idiot woman Yukai Hamiki has the same mange Kyo Sharingan as that bastard Yukai Hamadara, so she restrains herself very much. Those two named Roy and Liu Ohao are really scary. Sensing the terrifying energy vaguely emerging from Roy and Liu Ohao, Nine Tails shivered in aggrievedness. Yuzu Maki Kashina, a bad woman, was able to bully her with her sealing technique a few years ago. Now that these monsters are added to the mix, won't he never have the chance to be free again in this life? Nine Tails? I hope that little guy can be more honest in the future. Roy and the others chuckled, glaring at Kashina's belly threateningly. In fact, they probably knew what Nine Tails was thinking, and they understood that they acted honestly because they were frightened by themselves and others. But to be honest, neither Roy nor Yuakai or Mickey ever took Nine Tails seriously, because it's not strong enough. If it's Ten Tails, it's worth saying, it's really not weak. Nine Tails? Suzu and Wooden Gillum Jutsu are just toys, not worth mentioning. The chat continues, so handsome. Sister Liu Hao is actually the god slayer of other world? Does your world actually have gods? You are actually over 200 years old? Your skin is better than mine, you can't tell it at all. World noble? Noble phantasm. Mr. Roy is also very powerful. Even the powerful sister Liu Hao is no match for you. After learning information about the god slayer, noble phantasm and other other world from Roy and others, Yuzu Maki Kashina exclaimed repeatedly, looking very much like a member of the atmosphere team. Little did she know that she was really surprised and envied her best friend Yuakai Hamiki for being able to see such a vast sky. Unlike her, who came to Konoa with her family broken up when she was a child, and then became Nine Tails Jinchuriki and was constantly monitored. It was not until she became Chunin that she could leave the village to do tasks and gain some freedom. Listening to the wonders and existence of these other worlds, Yuzu Maki Kashina even felt a little jealous in her heart. It turns out that Miki is not only much stronger than me, but her vision is no longer at the same level as mine. Actually, I am also very capable. Keenly aware that Kashina's mood had become a little depressed for no reason, Kasuma Gokushiu suddenly interrupted. Um, Yuakai Hamiki looked at Kasuma Gokushiu in surprise, and then her eyes lit up. I remember that your ability is to stop time, Senpai, right? That's right. Kasuma Gokushi raised her hand and brushed the hair beside her ears, as if to show off. But this trick was really effective and immediately attracted Yuzu Maki Kashina's attention. Time stops. Yuzu Maki Kashina opened her mouth wide, with surprise written on her face. It won't really stop time like I imagined, right? That's right, that's it. Yuakai Hamiki smiled and hugged Yuzu Maki Kashina's slender waist, leaned close to her ear and whispered softly, It would be great if I also had this ability. For example, I could stop time to you Kashina dot 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 he 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 he, uck dot 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 you bad guy. Kashina's pretty face turned red, and she didn't know whether she was angry or ashamed. Kashina gently patted the rear car light of her best friend and pushed her away from her. Then Kashina looked at Kasuma Gokushiu curiously, can you show it to me? I have already seen the ninjutsu of space, and the ninjutsu of time. It's really unheard of, certainly. Kasuma Gokushiu smiled slightly and looked sideways at Roy and Liu Ohao, Master Liu Ohao, Mr. World Noble, do you two also want to experience what it feels like to stop time? Can. Liu Ohao's beautiful eyes were full of expectation, even among the powers of countless disobedient gods, stopping time is definitely powerful. I naturally want to experience it myself. Yeah. I'm also curious about what that would feel like. Roy also nodded in agreement. He had seen many works in the Time Stop series in his previous life. There are two-dimensional ones and there are real ones, and I'm tired of them all. But experiencing it firsthand is definitely something new. Well, since you all agree, I can use it with confidence. He felt relieved. Kasuma Gokusha had been worried that his ability would cause dissatisfaction among his friends, so he naturally did not dare to use it indiscriminately in front of Roy and others. Now that Roy and others had agreed, she felt a little impatient. Can the stop time for 5 seconds ability that I got from the chat group really work on strong people like Roy? Can I, an ordinary person from the everyday world, become as strong as everyone in the chat group? Seeing a wider world, and being shocked by the battle between Roy and Liu Ohao, Kasuma Gokushi felt a strange sense of urgency in his heart. She didn't want to be someone who could only stand behind others and be protected. She also wants to be strong. Time. Stop it. The ordinary words came out of the girl's mouth, and in an instant, Strange energy enveloped the entire world. The birds in the sky stopped moving forward, the flowing river stopped flowing, and the falling leaves stopped in midair, as if everything in the world was stuck. Time was stopped, there was no doubt about it. As early as in his own world, Kasuma Gokusha had already tested the ability to stop time many times, 
but what she really cares about is whether her ability will be effective on Roy and other powerful people. Looking at the motionless figures in front of him, as if they had turned into ice sculptures and slept, Kasuma Gokushu suppressed the excitement in her heart and raised her slender palm to gently caress Roy's cheek. It seems to have been successful, Mr. World Noble. Her ruby-like delicate eyes looked directly at Roy gently, Kasuma Gokushu said softly, from this point of view, do I also have the potential to become a strong man? and can I fight side by side with you in the future? Chapter 32 The Devil Who Tempts Angels to Fall Time is a very important factor in combat. For the strong, even a difference of 0.01 seconds is enough to turn the tide of a battle. For a weak person like Kasuma Gokushu, stopping time for 5 seconds is enough for her to stab the enemy in front of her with a dagger. Of course, this is all ideal. In fact, many enemies won't be this close to you. Not to mention that there are countless blood cows with full defense in all the worlds. It is common for attacks from the weak to fail to break through the defense. Therefore, even if ordinary people have the terrifying ability to stop time, they can usually only hang out in the low-level world and cannot be called strong at all. But Kasuma Gokushu is undoubtedly lucky. Coming from a daily world, she has gained a cheat called a chat group, and most of her group members are relatively amiable. This means that with the help of everyone, she can transcend the limits of her own world and have the opportunity to reach a higher level of life. Dot. The five seconds stopped quickly. Everything in the world that was forcibly stagnant returned to normal. What's wrong? Why are you looking at us like this? Yuzu Maki Kashina looked at Kasuma Gokushu in surprise. You can start stopping time, Miss Yu. Yuakai Hamiki was silent for a rare moment, her eyebrows slightly furrowed, as if she noticed something was wrong. As a god killer, Liu Ohao was more perceptive and said uncertainly. Did time stop just now? I felt an irregular wind blowing from the side of my face. Dot 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 you can feel this? Roy glanced at Liu Ohao in shock, and once again truly felt how big the gap in combat experience between him and her was. Don't tell me you don't feel anything? Liu Ohao frowned and looked at Roy, as if he was dissatisfied with his slackness. This woman, who had just been violently beaten by Roy, instead of feeling fear and disgust, actually cared more about Roy. I have a feeling, but I'm not as sure as you are. Roy had an awkward smile on his face but he glanced at Kasuma Gokushu unconsciously. The latter was looking away at this time, deliberately not looking at him. But Roy didn't think he felt wrong. Someone did touch his face just now without him noticing at all. Considering Kasuma Gokushu's ability, the answer is obvious. But dot 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 why is this woman touching my face? And in front of Liu Ohao and the other girls, he only touched me. There was something unclear about Kasuma Gokushu's thoughts in his heart, and it was not easy to ask her in front of so many people, so Roy kept this matter secretly in his heart. Speaking of which, is Kasuma Gokushu's ability to stop time so terrifying? Recalling the weird feeling of someone touching his face for no reason just now, Roy couldn't help but shuddered and felt goosebumps rising. This ability to be perfectly activated no matter how many times weaker than the enemy is, is undoubtedly what everyone dreams of. It's simply cheating. Ah, on the side, a look of disappointment appeared on Yuzu Maki Kashina's pretty face. So time really stopped just now? But I didn't feel anything. It's very easy to feel something. Kasuma Gokushu smiled evilly and stopped time again. This time she didn't attack Roy alone, but everyone present. And in order to give Yuzu Maki Kashina a good experience, she her Kasuma Goku took extra care of her. Five seconds passed quickly. Time flows again. Ah, Yuzu Maki Kashina exclaimed and raised her hand, staring at Kasuma Gokushu with a shy and annoyed look. This time, she really felt the effect of stopping time, and she couldn't fake it. On the side feeling someone caressing his cheek without noticing it at all. Liu Ohao, the god slayer, felt the power of time. What an incredible power, little girl. The abilities you have gained are definitely no worse than anyone else in the group. When Liu Ohao looked at Kasuma Gokushu, his eyes changed from indifference to a little person to recognition of a talented person. She even started to dream about it. If one day Kasuma Gokushu can train herself to be strong enough, with the ability to stop time, she can completely defeat enemies much stronger than herself across levels because this ability currently seems to be very unsolvable. Ah, is it really that powerful? Unexpectedly, Liu Hao would recognize his ability so much. Kasuma Gokushu's face turned red and she was a little embarrassed. After hesitating for a moment, she looked at Liu Hao cautiously. Master Liu Hao, can you teach me Chinese martial arts? No. Contrary to the expectations of everyone present, Liu Hao rejected her without hesitation. Your talent is too average and cannot meet my requirements for accepting a disciple so I will not waste my time on you. That's it dot 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 I understand. Unexpectedly, she got such a reply after mustering up the courage to become a disciple. Kasuma Goku she couldn't help but look sad and her mood became a little depressed. But she doesn't blame Liu Ohao for this. From the chat group, I learned about the unerring character of this female god killer. Since the other party said that she had poor talent, she was definitely not wrong. Senior, don't be sad. On the side, looking at the dejected Shiha Kasuma Goku, 
Yuikai Hamiki felt that her heart was about to break. You will be rewarded for coming to my world to do the mission this time. Maybe you will be lucky enough to draw a Renegan or a Tensigan. Such powerful abilities. Well dot 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 thank you for your comfort. A beautiful smile reappeared on Kasuma Gokushiu's face, but a hint of cunning flashed in her eyes, and she said in an ambiguous tone, Yuikai has little pervert. Ah ah, senior sister, kill me, senior sister. You are so beautiful. I really like how you call my name in this tone. Being slightly seduced by Kasuma Gokushiha, Yuikai Hamiki became excited instantly and wanted to rush over and bury her head in her senior sister's arms. But Roy interrupted the nympho without mercy. If you don't get a satisfactory reward after this trip to the Hokage world, I can help you for a fee. Looking at Kasuma Gokushiu's red jade eyes that were more delicate and beautiful than any gem in his collection, Roy's tone was gentle, but he was like a devil tempting an angel to fall. Chapter 33 Two People's Confession to Kasuma Gokushu, please collect it. Hey hey hey, your highness Roy, what are you talking about? Hearing that Roy was seducing his lovely senior, Yuikai Hamiki suddenly shouted dissatisfied. I can also steal a battery car to support my senior bar. I can also teach my senior the secrets of the ninja world. After saying this, as if to prove that she was not lying, Yuikai Hamiki immediately took out several seal scrolls from her waist. This is the secret technique of my Yuikai Her clan's fire style. This is the eight inner gates formation that was awarded to me by dot 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 you guys know what that thing is. These are various five element escape techniques from the third generation old man's family. At one stroke, he took out four or five secret scrolls that would be snapped up by every village in the ninja world, and spread them out in front of Kasuma Gokushu, just like laying out a real estate certificate on a blind date. After laying out all of this, it seems that it is not enough. Yuakai Hamiki gritted her teeth again and said, As long as you can accept me, senior, I can get you even the Sharingan of the Yuakai clan and the Byakugan of the Hyuga clan. Are this? Roy looked on stunned. The slut is not content with taking advantage of her words, but actually strikes hard. Yuzu Maki Kashina, who was still watching the excitement, was so shocked that she couldn't even speak. She stared blankly at her beautiful best friend, feeling so strange. Mother, I saw a girl confessing to a girl, etc. So, Muki actually likes girls? Question mark. Yuzu Maki Kashina's face changed slightly. Apparently she remembered something, and her eyes when looking at Yuakai Hamiki suddenly became extremely complicated. She was not an idiot. After discovering that Yuakai Hamiki liked girls, she certainly realized that the unusual closeness between him and her was not normal. That's it. It's not a big deal if you like girls. It's not a shameful bad thing. But there are several girls in Konoha who are as close as him to use Yumaki Kashina. She even confessed her love to a beautiful girl from other world in front of her. Fraud. Scumbag. He didn't notice that his beloved best friend looked at her with eyes full of resentment. Yuakai Hamiki was eagerly waiting for Kasuma Gokushiu's reply. Facing the confession of Yuakai Hamiki, who is also a woman, Kasuma Gokushiu was obviously stunned, and it took a while to realize what happened. Sorry, please allow me to refuse. Rarely without a venomous tongue. Kasuma Gokushi bit her lip and said without mercy, I'm still pretty sure that what I like is a man. Ah, what's so good about a man? How can he be so fragrant as a girl? Yuakai Hamiki pouted and wailed, if you don't believe me, look at his highness Roy. He probably has more ninjas in his harem than my family. Even if this is the case, you are only half measured. A voice with a light tone but full of coldness came from behind, freezing Yuakai Hamiki. 9. Dot 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 Kashina, the brain occupied by GHS completely woke up. And Yuakai Hamiki finally remembered that another target of her attack was also present. She tried to step on two boats. No, she stepped on several boats and was discovered. Shora Field is here. You, 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 Kashina, listen to me and explain to you. Yuakai Hamiki pulled Kashina up and walked away, trying to restore her impression in her mind. No matter if you are a scumbag or a scumbag, you will always fall apart one day, right? Mr. World Noble, with a gloating smile on his face, Kasuma Gokushi looked at Roy and joked. After all, People can't hide their desires for a lifetime. I never hide my desires, so I don't have any worries in this regard, Roy said with a gentle smile. That's true. Kasuma Gokushi looked at him helplessly. I don't shy away from the fact that I am a scumbag, Mr. World Noble. Roy chuckled, not caring about Kasuma Gokushi's venomous tongue, and asked instead, How about it? Have you considered it? Kasuma Gokushi didn't reply immediately, seeming to be considering the feasibility of this matter. Roy was not in a hurry and continued slowly, The ninja method may be very suitable for you. But as you have no foundation, what you need most is definitely not some mysterious technique, but something more essential. It's physical fitness. Liu Oha, who had been silent for a while, suddenly interrupted and then looked up at Roy. The group announcement said that there is a specialty product called Devil Fruit in the pirate world, and the zone ability in it can strengthen the physical fitness of the eater. Zone. The corner of his mouth twitched slightly, and Kasuma Gokushu's face clearly showed a look of disgust. Although she is now very eager to become stronger and catch up with Roy and others. This does not mean that she wants to become an ugly monster. 
She couldn't help but shudder when she thought about turning into one of those sphinxes or monsters with human heads and snake bodies in the underwater prison in Roy's previous live broadcast. How about forgetting it? Kasumagoka she whispered sheepishly, although strength is indeed important, but to become an ugly monster. The price is too high, right? Regarding this point, Roy actually has the same idea as Kasumagoka she whether you are strong or not is only a temporary matter, but whether you are handsome or not is a lifelong matter. Of course, in the world of pirates, there are actually many fruit abilities that are both strong and handsome, but most of the fruit abilities are affected by the owner's poor appearance. Typical examples are the shining fruit and the phoenix fruit. Given the gorgeousness of the fruit's ability and super good looks, if the owner were a handsome boy or a beautiful girl, wouldn't the popularity skyrocket? What's more, Roy never hides his desires. He was willing to help Kasuma Gokushu because he liked her, so naturally he would not give her an ugly ability. But then again, it's really troublesome. If this were in the pirate world, he would be kidnapped directly and have a second child in two years. Unfortunately, this is a chat group. Even though Roy's personality in the group is that of a bad guy and scumbag, he still has to worry about the feelings between his group members. So, Roy comforted him softly. Don't worry, the devil fruit I gave you will definitely be strong and beautiful. After all, if you really become ugly, then I should be the one crying. Pfft he is really a magnanimous scumbag Tilda. Kasuma Goka she couldn't help but laugh. She didn't know whether she should praise Roy for his magnanimity or despise him for only caring about beauty. Having said that, this is actually the same confession as you at Kaiho Mickey just now, right? But dot 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 I don't know if it's because she's not a lily girl, but she doesn't hate Roy like this at all. That's right. Liu Oh How on the side also nodded in agreement, looking at Roy with eyes full of recognition. A gentleman is magnanimous and a villain is always caring. You already have the qualities of our devil king. Buzz, as Liu Ohau finished speaking, Kasuma Gokushu suddenly stopped time. In a world where everything was still, Kasuma Gokushu approached Roy with blushing cheeks and pecked him gently on the cheek. For Shu Kasuma Goka, who seems to have a strong and generous personality, but is actually hesitant and reserved in nature, this is the answer she gives. Chapter 34 Third Reikage, The Tragic Experience of Demigods the five seconds when time stopped passed quickly. In the distance, Yuikai Hamiki and Yuzumaki Kashina were having a conflict, completely unaware of it. Liu Hao frowned slightly, sensing something strange in the flow of the wind as before. Little girl, what did you just do? She looked at Kasuma Gokushu curiously, wondering why he suddenly stopped time. Kasuma Gokushu didn't speak, but lowered his head, trying to hide his blushing cheeks. Roy, who obviously felt that the side of his face was a little moist and had a faint fragrance, looked at Kasuma Gokushu with a subtle expression feeling speechless in his heart. Is this woman so shy? She clearly looked quite bold in the original novel. Having said that, it really is a Times top series. Roy felt a very strange and exciting feeling when he thought that Kasuma Goka shipped him in front of Liu Ohau in a world where time stopped. Girls, know how to play. Cough, cough. Knowing that the girl who had just begun to fall in love was a bit embarrassed, Roy coughed dryly to attract Liu Ohau's attention and change the subject. How do you want to complete your Kaihamiki's chat group task? What about Revenge Wagakure? Sure enough, his attention was immediately diverted. Liu Ohau's beautiful face showed a ferocious smile that was completely inconsistent with his painting style. After waking up, I saw a lot of information about this world in the chat history. I plan to attack the Wagakure directly! Exclamation mark I think it should get a good evaluation. Attacking the Wagakure base camp directly? It is indeed a good decision. Roy nodded and had to say that Liu Ohau really made an excellent decision. Now that the Hokage world is in the midst of the third ninja war, Wagakure's remaining combat power is already quite empty. With Liu Ohau's terrifying strength as a god killer, it is not impossible to completely destroy him. Don't look at it. Roy seemed to have an easy time beating Liu Ohau before. That's because the strength of Roy's noble phantasm is so high, it's the same as cheating. Not to mention anything else, even if it is just the dragon roaring tiger roaring technique that Liu Ohau possesses. As long as she is given enough singing time, she can blow a country into the sky or destroy it in a storm. In a sense, it can even surpass natural disasters. If Roy had just time traveled through time, he would have hugged Liu Ohau's golden thighs and eaten soft food without hesitation. But Roy had another goal at this time. Just when Liu Ohau was severely injured and fainted, he got a piece of information from Yuikai Hamuki. The Wagakure is secretly mobilizing an extremely large force recently for an unknown purpose. This information is actually not a secret among the major powers in the ninja world. To be honest, if such a large-scale personnel transfer could still be hidden, the leaders of the intelligence agencies of several other countries could just have a disembowelment to apologize. But no one really knows what Iwagakure's goal is in this war. However, both Roy and Yuikai Hamiki knew. As time travelers who have watched Hokage Ninja, how could they not understand the famous events that happened in the Third Ninja War? Third Reikijurf's 10,000 Rock Shinobi Ninjas. One against 10,000, fight to the death with all your strength. Originally, Yuikai Hamiki had no intention of intervening in this matter. Konoa is actually pretty good to her, 
Uaga cures her enemy, and so is Cloud Shinobi Village. If a dog bites a dog, it's best to lose both sides. Moreover, even now she dare not say that she can come and go freely among 10,000 ninjas, high attack and low defense can't afford it. But the arrival of Roy and others changed her mind. In the original work of Hokage, Third Ray Ikage must have killed a lot of the Wagakure's ninjas, but it certainly didn't injure Wagakure. In that case, why not give them a hard blow? Yuakai Hamiki does not intend to destroy Wagakure easily, doing so will not do her any good. But if a Wagakure's vitality is seriously injured, the war will end faster, and he can go back to flirting with young ladies. Long live the sweet and soft little sister. So, Yuakai Hamiki revealed this information to Roy. And Roy is naturally very interested in Third Ray Ikage. The man who has practiced the lightning style to the ultimate is said to have both the strongest shield and the strongest spear. Killing such a powerful man with a great reputation in the ninja world and taking away his life and legend, what kind of amazing treasure can be created? Just thinking about it made Roy impatient. Dot. In the blink of an eye, it was three days later. It was already the fourth day that Roy and his team came to the world of Hokage. In three days, they will be forced to return to their own world by the chat group. These three days were undoubtedly quite painful for Yuakai Hamuki. Yuakai Hamuki, why? It's obvious that senior sister is happy when she comes to my world. Sister Leader is also happy when she comes to my world, and Kashina is even happier when she is by my side. Yuakai Hamuki, obviously the three pieces of happiness added together should become a greater happiness. Yuakai Hamuki, why in the end, not only did Senior reject me, but even Kashina ignored me. Dot. Yuakai Hamuki chatters in the chat group like Sister Xianglin, but in the real world, she has dull eyes and looks like she has been spoiled. She has been in this state for several days and can only return to normal if a few girls present give her a kiss and a hug. In the chat group, Asts, whose mind is full of fighting, will naturally not sympathize with her. Only the young Sigura could make her feel a little warm. Not far away, Yuzu Maki Kashina rolled her eyes, feeling very helpless towards her best friend. To be honest, with Yuakai Hamiki's stunning beauty and sweet-tongued mouth, even if she really likes herself, Yuzu Maki Kashina is actually not unacceptable. But, Yuikurenai, Shizun, Yuakai Hamikoto, myself, Tsunade Sama, and even suspected to be a few from outside the village. Among them were teenage girls, some in their thirties and forties, and even her own sister. It's just because Kashina is a woman and she hasn't successfully conquered it yet, otherwise she would have killed this guy long ago. Ah, uh, sure enough, I still can't forgive this scumbag. The more I thought about it, the angrier I became, and my original intention to forgive her because of her pity suddenly faded away. Yuzu Maki Kashina simply walked straight towards Roy who was about to set off. Mr. Roy, if you can. Please take me with you. A restless little pepper at heart, Yuzu Maki Kashina looked eager to try. Tens of thousands of people surrounded one person. If I miss such a shocking scene, I will regret it for the rest of my life. There's no problem in taking you with me, but do the people in your village allow you, Nine Tails Jinchuriki, to run around? Roy asked curiously. It does not matter. Yuzu Maki Kashina giggled. I ran out secretly with him. Dot 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 that scumbag. No one in the village can find me. All right. Roy shrugged and said. I will take you with me. You can also help me protect you. Yes, Kasuma Gokushiu is also going with Roy. After all, she has no fighting power except time stop. It is impossible to stay here alone. She can only choose one of Liu Oha and Roy. And because of the previous confession incident, it is obvious that Kasuma Gokushiu's relationship with Roy is now closer. Good. After getting Roy's answer, Yuzu Maki Kashina suddenly shouted happily. Then just seeing her, body flicker technique flashed to Kasuma Gokushiu and hugged her arm affectionately. Don't worry. Little Shu, I will definitely protect you. Well dot 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 thank you. After these few days of contact, Kasuma Gokushiu had a rough understanding of Yuzu Maki Kashina's character and knew that she was a cheerful and sunny woman, so she calmly accepted her kindness. Yuakai Hamuki, Yu 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 Kashina, my Kashina, Roy Sama, you are actually the yellow hair of the pirate world. Yuakai Hamuki, obviously everyone is a scumbag, why do I have to go through the Shura field, but you can hug me left and right, not far away. Yuakai Hamiki was even more sad when she saw this scene, and even accused Roy in the group. Tasuka Sigura, poor Mickey's sister, asks, What a boring love story, are you finally going to do a mission? I can't wait to watch the live broadcast. Liu Oha, wait a minute, I had an accident. Following Liu Oha's speech, Roy and others in the Hokage world immediately saw a 3, 000 meter tall Vajra Rishi suddenly appearing in the distance, like a towering mountain. Boom. The mountain high Vajra warrior punched out, and instantly the mountain collapsed and the earth cracked. The terrifying impact swept away everything around him, causing a deafening sound that could be heard dozens of miles away. Liu Ohao, okay, it's okay, it's been solved. Liu Ohao, I was doing rehabilitation training here when I met a group of ninjas. They must have been attracted by the noise caused by the battle between me and Roy four days ago. Liu Ohao, the leader seems to be the leader of Rain Shinobi village, named Hanzo. Liu Ohao, 
The strength is quite strong, although the strength of the 3000 meter Vajra Rikishi is far less than that of the 20 meter ninja. Other ninjas were smashed into pulp. He was the only one who was not killed by a punch, which is enough to call him a strong man! Exclamation mark. Chapter 35 Yuakai Hamuki, Am I being bullied again? Liu Oha, picture, is this guy Yuakai Hamuki, although he was beaten until he couldn't see his human form. Dot dot dot, but it is indeed Hanzo of the Salamander the leader of Rain Shinobi Village, known as a demigod. This unlucky guy actually met the leader's sister, Roy. Well, that's quite unlucky. Yamamoto Genri Uzai King U, everyone has his own destiny. It would be better to say that Hanzo is still alive when he meets the god killer Liu Ohau. It is his great luck. Liu Ohau, is this guy still a demigod? At this level, looking at Hanzo who was as motionless as a dead dog at his feet, Liu Ohau really couldn't understand why this man could enjoy the title of demigod. If she remembers correctly, the top combat powers in the Hokage world can explode, right? Can this Hanzo break a mountain? Leader Liu Ohau, who doesn't know much about comics, naturally won't understand that this is the only way for long-term serialized works to expand combat power. In the early Hokage novels, third Hokage Sarutobi Hayaruzen is still the strongest Hokage in history, and Kakazu, that bastard, can still fight first Hokage Senju Hashirama. Roy, just think that he is bragging. People are so good at it. It's not illegal to brag. Right? Liu Oha, well dot 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 it makes sense. Yuakai Hamiki colon dot 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 poor Hanzo. But I still pity me for not being abandoned by Kashina. Liu Oha, so, what should we do with this Hanzo? Liu Oha, at Nairona middle dot Roishing, do you want me to kill him? He is a legend in the ninja world and has his own unique legend. I think if I kill him, I can get a good treasure. Tools, Roy, thank you very much, Master Liu Oha. Liu Oha, there is no need to express gratitude for the relationship between us. And Liu Ohau is my name. I allow you to call me by my first name, Killian. Yuakai Hamuki. Roy Colon. Dot, 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 I'd better call you Liu Ohau. The name Killian always feels a bit strange. Liu Ohau, it's up to you. The name is just a code name. While chatting with everyone in the group, Liu Ohau brought back the dying Hanzo. TSK, isn't this guy too unlucky? Looking down at Hanzo's distorted face, Yuakai Hamuki sighed. I was born in a small country like the Land of Rain and was constantly bullied by the big countries around it. I finally made a counterattack and gained a lot of fame, but then I met the god killer from Otherworld. Why, aren't you Kono also part of those who bullied the Land of Rain? Why are you pretending to be a good person here? Rolling his eyes at this idiot who had been trying to steal women from him, Roy pushed Yuakai Hamiki away and took out an ordinary treasure from his god's treasure. Laugh, a sword seals the throat. The demigod who lived in the ninja world for half his life and gave Tsunade, Jiryu, and Okaimaru the name Sanin died so easily. With Hanzo's death, the Akatsuki organization can take over Rain Shinobi Village more than ten years in advance. Looking at Hanzo's body, Yuakai Hamiki gloated. Well, it's just a battlefield for a big country. If you die more than ten years ago, maybe Rain Shinobi Village can do better. Stop talking about this boring guy. Completely ignoring Hanzo's life and death, Liu Ohau looked at Roy curiously. I am looking forward to it just like the god-killing queen usurping power. What kind of noble phantom did you get this time? Well dot 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 it's a bit hard to describe. Roy said the name of this treasure with a strange expression. Come, demigod. Buzz, golden light emerged, and a figure filled with dazzling gold appeared in front of everyone. I'll go. Golden sparkle. Yuakai Hamiki exclaimed loudly. In the live broadcast of the chat group, Yamamoto Genri Uzaikin was speechless colon dot 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 jin shining shining. You are such a bitch. Isn't this obviously Hanzo? R? It's true. And it's a golden limited edition? Yuakai Hamiki looked at it in surprise and found that the person Roy summoned was actually Hanzo of the Salamander who had just died in front of them. However, Hanzo's skin, clothes and even his pupils are now golden, and his whole body seems to be plated with gold. No wonder Yuakai Hamiki blurts out gold glitter, it is indeed an exaggeration. Come, demigod, level, level 1, type, summoning noble phantasm, permanent liberation, attack range, none, killing the demigod Hanzo of the Salamander and using the divine power of the Hand of Hermes to create fantasy weapons. Since Hanzo stood in the ninja world as a demigod during his lifetime, after liberating this noble phantasm, he will be able to regain his demigod posture. Dot. After posting the relevant information about this noble phantasm in the group, Roy felt it was hard to explain. It doesn't seem to be of any use. Yuakai Hamiki is a little gloating, she really likes seeing Roy unlucky now. Ace Des, who has been following the live broadcast, also spoke, indeed. Although Hanzo summoned by the Liberation Noble Phantasm has become younger, and his body has a strength comparable to the Noble Phantasm, and his strength has definitely improved a lot, but you really don't have that for Roy. Any use? Sigura Tasuka, it doesn't matter. Brother Roy will definitely get a powerful enough Noble Phantasm later. Roy, I'll lend you my blessing, little Sigura. You look very cute today too. Tasuka Sigura, Roy brother is also very handsome. Dot.
After praising little Sura in the group, Roy glanced at Yuakai Hamiki who looked at his joke, who said this thing is useless. I said, Yuakai Hamiki looked unconvinced, neither strong nor handsome, isn't this just a bottom of the box noble phantasm? Just like a lot of low level noble phantasms in your god's treasure. HMPH, the king has the talent of the king, and the chef has the talent of the chef. You idiot, you probably only have strength and appearance in your mind. After scolding Yuakai Hamiki, Roy turned to look at Golden Hanzo and ordered, from today on, you are Hanzo of the Salamander who has practiced Sage Mode. When you go back, you will find a way to recruit all the Akatsuki organization and its members as subordinates. Do you understand? Question mark. Yes, Master. Golden Hanzo, who inherited everything from Hanzo and was more powerful than his predecessor, but completely obeyed Roy, knelt down respectfully, then stood up and left quickly. Akatsuki organization. Looking at the back of Golden Hanzo, Yuikai Hamiki's beautiful eyes suddenly widened and she raised her hand and pointed at Roy in disbelief, Your Highness Roy, are you targeting Conan? He he. Roy smiled but said nothing. Ah, uh, no. Sister Angel is also my target. A shrill wail came out of her mouth, and Yuakai Hamiki was like a thunderbolt in the clear sky, dumbfounded on the spot. How could she forget this usefulness of Hanzo as the leader of the Kingdom of Rain? The betrayal of the Akatsuki organization in the original work has not yet happened, and Hanzo can completely take over the Akatsuki organization. By then, wouldn't Conan be Roy's back? At this moment, even though Conan didn't recognize him yet, Yuakai Hamiki still felt that he was bullied by Roy. That is one of the wives I have booked. Let's start the chat group task quickly. Otherwise it will be too late. Dare not waste any more time. Otherwise God knows if Roy will steal his future wives again. Yuakai Hamiki said eagerly, Your Highness Roy, take senior sister and Kashina to the third Reikage. I will take the leader sister and go straight there. Iwagakure, go, go, go. Don't waste any more time. Chapter 36 The Fall of Iwagakure Please collect, monthly votes, evaluation votes, flowers, and data. What the hell are these? The Land of Fire, Konoa, the third Hokage, who is not yet old, frowned and looked at the information in his hand with dissatisfaction. A battle between mysterious strong men destroyed dozens of kilometers of forest. Others have witnessed Vajra Rishi who is at least two or three thousand meters high and shatters the earth with one punch. Nonsense. As someone who has seen Suzu and Wood style with his own eyes, Sarutobi Hiruzen can tell at a glance that this is all fake news. How could there be someone stronger than Jedi in the ninja world? This is obviously false news deliberately created by other villages, just to confuse Konoa and distract their energy and troops. Don't worry about this information, Third Hokage Sarutobi Hiruzen ordered disdainfully, finding Kashina, the Nine Tails Jinchuriki, and protecting her safety are the top priority. And Yuakai Hamiki. This child should be devoted to Konoa and is a good child. But other members of the Uakaiha clan may not. Sarutobi Hiruzen frowned as he thought of this girl from the Uakaiha clan who had beautiful appearance, amazing talent and high reputation in the village. It is most likely that Nine Tails Jinchuriki was abducted out of her own will. But what if it is the conspiracy of the Uakaiha clan? Humphrey. Dot. Roy and others didn't know that the third Hokage regarded their existence as false news, although even if they knew, they probably wouldn't care. Sarutobi Hiruzen is actually quite talented in the study of ninjutsu. Unfortunately, the most important thing in the Hokage world is blood. He was destined to be a ninja with little talent when he was born. Ready to go. Although Yuakai Hamiki urged everyone to prevent Roy from continuing to look for girls, Roy and others did not object to her words. After all, we have already traveled four days. If something unexpected happens again and we are forcibly repatriated before completing the mission on the seventh day, it will be really fun. So as mentioned before, everyone divided into two groups. Come, Leviathan. The Dragon of Chaos. Reciting the word Spirit of the Liberation Noble Phantasm, Roy's body surged with divine power. J. A. Uh, under Yuzumaki Kashina's shocked gaze, a huge bone dragon at least a hundred meters long fell from the sky, making a terrifying roar. This. This is too big. In Yuzumaki Kashina's opinion, the nine tails sealed in her body is already huge enough. The bone dragon summoned by Roy is at least ten times the size of nine tails. Thinking back to the fleeting 3000 meter King Kong Rikishi just now, Yuzumaki Kashina couldn't help but sigh that people from other worlds are simply monsters. With such thoughts in mind, Yuzumaki Kashina suddenly heard her scumbag best friend say in a very ambiguous tone, Why have you become so young? Your Highness Roy, do you really like to challenge my dignity as a man? Roy glared at Yuakai Hamuki, you'd better pray that it's time to return after I solve the third Reikage, otherwise prepare to be bullied severely by me. After saying this, Roy hugged the two girls, Yuzumaki Kashina and Kasuma Gokushiha, who were still stunned one on the left and the other on the right, and jumped up and landed on the broad back of the bone dragon. Boom! Exclamation mark. The ground trembled violently, and the bone dragon flew into the air, straight into the sky. Sigh. He not only wants to steal my wife, but also bullies me. How about I just take my wives and marry him together? Anyway, the Tanlong people are so rich, 
I won't lose no matter what. With wishful thinking in her heart, Yuikai Hamiki sighed in her heart and looked sideways at Liu Hao. Master, have you seen the map? Um, facing Yuikai Hamiki, Liu Hao's attitude was much cooler. Without saying a word, she directly raised her hand and grabbed Yuikai Hamiki's arm. Shakaboga Miyashito. This is a martial skill that can span thousands of miles in an instant. Liu Hao has practiced this technique to the ultimate level and can reach anywhere on the planet with just a thought. So Yuakai Hamiki felt her eyes blurred for a while, and when she opened her eyes again, densely packed rock houses appeared in her sight. The Wagakure, arrived. Dot. That dot 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 Mr. Roy. Standing on the back of the bone dragon, a little unsteady due to the wind, Yuzu Makikashina grabbed Roy's arm and asked carefully, Can I ask what that scumbag meant when she said the bone dragon was very small? That's what it means literally, Miss Ninetales Fox. Kasuma Goka she also grabbed Roy's other arm and explained with longing, if Mr. World Nobleman fully releases the bone dragon summoned by this precious phantom, its size can span more than a dozen islands, and it can truly cover the sky. It's a huge thing that blocks out the sun. Is this so powerful? Yuzu Maki Kashina opened her mouth in surprise, and she didn't even care about the strange nickname Kasuma Gokushi who gave herself. It's indeed very powerful, but Kasuma Gokushi covered her mouth and smiled evilly. If you release all your strength, Mr. World Nobleman will lose his strength in an instant and will not be able to last long. Are this? Yuzu Maki Kashina's pretty face turned slightly red. She felt that Shikasuma Goku was talking about naughty things, but there was no evidence. I said, don't say bad things in front of me, okay? Sandwich between the two women, Roy had a dark look on his face. I just got this noble phantasm and was not yet proficient at it. Now I can no longer lose its power. Ah, really? Kasuma Goku she joked. Then Mr. World Noble, why don't you try your best to liberate the noble phantasm now? but specifically control the size of the bone dragon. Dot. Roy had nothing to say and could only give Kasuma Gokushi a fierce look. There will always be times when you regret it in the future. Sooner or later, I will let you experience the horror of the pirate world's war between people for ten days and ten nights without sleep. Kasuma Gokushi. Use you Maki Kashina. Now it was the two women's turn to have nothing to say. After all, no matter how foul-mouthed he is, he is still just an inexperienced chick, and his face is far inferior to that of Roy who was living and drinking in the pirate world. But, ten days and ten nights, are you really not going to kill people to death? She imagined some horrific scenes in her mind, and Kasuma Gokushu's cheeks turned red as if she was drunk. This made her feel fear and expectation at the same time. Dot. Damn, those bastards the Wagakure ambushed us, assholes. They were condescending and had the strength of their numbers. They caught us off guard. Take everyone and retreat quickly. I will stand behind you. Wa dot 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 what? How could we let you, third Reikage, sacrifice yourself? Stop talking nonsense. It is precisely because I am Ryakage that I have to bear the lives of everyone in the village on my shoulders. A force returning to Cloud Shinobi village was attacked by Wagakure on the way. This is a normal thing in the ninja world, especially now during the third ninja war. What's abnormal is that the number of ninjas sent by Wagakure this time was too many, and Cloud Shinobi village was completely crushed. Finally, third Ryakage took the initiative to step forward and officially began his 1 vs 10 comma legendary story. Flames, floods, thunder, strong winds. Hundreds and thousands of ninjutsu blasted towards Third Reikage like concentrated bombing. The scene was extremely spectacular. Third Reikage did not hide and allowed these ninjutsu to bombard him. And he just rushed through the crowd like crazy. And almost every second, several unlucky ones were torn to pieces by his lightning style 9 jutsu. Monster. This guy is a monster. Seeing these amazingly powerful ninjutsu, which can easily kill a jonin, the blast on Third Reikage did not leave even a trace of scar on the body. Many ninjas in a Wagakure were frightened to death. Fortunately, there are enough of them. 10,000 ninjas, even if they are tired, can kill the third Reikage who controls both the strongest shield and the strongest spear. The third Reikage and Rock Shinobi who were fighting did not notice that there was a strange bone dragon high in the sky looking down at them. Asts, this is the third Reikage you are talking about? So strong, so courageous. I really want to fight with him. Yamamoto, it's a pity that we won't have this opportunity. The third Reikage is destined to die in the hands of Mr. Roy. Yuakai Hamuki, picture. Haven't you started yet? We've already finished it, slash, in the picture she posted, it was a Wagakure who was swept by the demonic wind and turned into ruins. In the air, Liu Hao stepped on the hundred meter tall Vajra Rukishi, and next to him was Yuakai Hamiki's pale white Suza giant. Below them, there is third such a kid Onoki, whose arm has completely disappeared, covered in blood, and whose life or death is unknown. In the short time that Roy and others were on their way, the Wagakure, one of the five major forces in the ninja world, had fallen. Chapter 37 The Continent Falling from the Sky Please collect, monthly tickets, flowers, evaluation votes, thank you. A few minutes ago, Iwagakure, ha dot 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 ha dot 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 bastard. As a Jinchuriki, Han couldn't even take one of that woman's moves. Third such a kid Jonoki gasped for breath in the air, 
his eyes full of shock and panic. He never imagined that just after he sent out a force of 10,000 people to surprise the Third Reichage with great enthusiasm, his home base would suffer the same fate. No dot 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 it should be a worse fate. Suzu, who is almost identical to the original Yuakai Hamadara, and the 100-meter Kongo Rukishi, who has never appeared in the ninja world. These giants can smash the earth and split mountains with just one punch. They are ridiculously strong. In less than a few minutes, almost the entire Awaga cure was destroyed, with heavy casualties among ninjas and civilians. As a five-tails Jinchuriki, Han, also known as the Steam Ninja, had all his bones broken by a light palm from the mysterious woman who stepped on the Vajra Rikishi. This shouldn't be the strength of a ninja at all. At this moment, Onoki seemed to have returned to the scene when he faced Yuakai Hamadara when he was a boy. Both fear and anger, but also very sad and unable to resist. I am a Liuoha. I am the God Slayer and the Demon King. Facing this ninja who successfully blocked him, Liuoha gave Onoki a high degree of respect and shouted condescendingly, Remember this name forever, and then burn yourself crazily. The revenge, boy. What a bullshit God Slayer. Bastards of Konoa. I will fight with you. Dust escape. Not believing Liuoha's lies at all. Onoki roared, clasped his palms together, and even wanted to use a super large scale limit peeling technique to kill both Technique and Liu Ohao. But the next second, Liu Ohao's figure appeared behind him as if teleporting Shuchi Dharma and Shen Zetong. The twelve divine palms of Flying Phoenix Middle. Dan Yang Kofing. A palm containing the hot spell power of the sun struck Onoki's back like the sun coming down. What? So fast, it's too late to form a seal and release the dust release. Onoki was horrified and could only turn around and punch in response. Earth style middle dot super heavy rock technique. Boom. The hot palm technique and the weighted fist collided, creating a deafening explosion. Click. Third such a kid clearly heard the sound of bones breaking in his waist. Then, the arm he swung out was blown to pieces by Liu Ohao's astonishing strength, and was turned into ashes under the scorching sun. Boom, boom, boom. The not so tall body fell to the ground like a meteor leaving countless sonic boom clouds in the sky and crashing through countless broken walls before Onoki finally landed smoothly. Then there was their picture, that Roy and others saw in the chat group. The third such a cage was defeated. The surviving ninjas and civilians in Awagakure stared blankly at the two terrifying giants in the sky, completely forgetting to resist. Many people even knelt down and tried to beg Liu Ohao and the others to spare their lives. Just like Onoki said, the unreasonable moves like Suzu and Konga Rikishi are not in the same dimension as ordinary ninjas. Are you going to kill them all? Liu Oha, who has not yet fully enjoyed herself, slowly condenses the magic power in her body. As long as Yuakai Hamiki speaks, she will completely liberate her power and the Make Cloud Shinobi village completely disappear from this world. But Yuakai Hamiki rejected her. Forget it. Yuakai Hamiki shook her head and said, Uwagakure's demise so early will not do me any good, let alone black soil. Leg shadow. It can be cultivated and it can also be played as an enemy relationship. Wouldn't it be a pity to lose it like this? Um, not knowing Yuakai Hamiki's evil heart, Liu Ohao withdrew the condensing spell power and teleported away with Yuakai Hamiki. Are those two monsters gone? Saved. Quick, save Mr. Third Generation. Seeing that the two devils actually left like this, the surviving ninjas of Uwaga Cure felt very confused and lucky, and quickly launched a rescue operation. At the same time, Information about the god killer Liu Ohao and Yuakai Hamiki was also rapidly transmitted from the Wagakure to other outside countries. Dot. The chat group is live broadcast, everyone is still watching the third Reikage fight against 10,000 rock shinobi ninjas, and they are watching with great interest. Asts. Didn't I say before that ninjas in the Hokage world have high attack and low defense? Yamamoto Genri Uzai Karuha, there are a few exceptions, and this third Reikage is one of them. His physical strength and defensive power are estimated to have a place among many strong men in the world of pirates. Yuakai Hamuki, my sister, the leader and I have returned to the previous camp. How many people did the old man Third Reikage kill? Yamamoto, nearly 1,000 rock shinobi ninjas were killed, heavy casualties. Yamamoto Genri Uzai Karuha, however, Third Reikage's physical strength is also very fast, and he will be exhausted in a day at most. In the original work, he fought for three days and three nights before dying of exhaustion. It is probably because of his defense power that he was stalling for time. Tasukasura, at Nirona Middle Dart Royce. Brother Roy, please give Grandpa Reikage a good time when you do it. He is so pitiful. Dot. Different from the previous unlucky Hanzo. During the live broadcast, I witnessed with my own eyes the tragic scene in which Third Reikage fought for the rear of the village against 10,000 people. Most people in the chat group had a very good impression of him. Tragic heroes are inherently capable of arousing empathy from others. Fortunately, there is no virgin in the chat group. Even the kind-hearted little Sura just hopes that Roy will give Third Reikage a happy time. That's almost it. Looking at Kamu displayed below, who had defeated Iwagakure's Third Reikage for the unknown number of times, Roy stretched out in comfort. Ah, is Mr. World Nobleman finally going to take action? Kasuma Gokushu asked curiously, 
Are you planning to use the Hercules belt or the God's avoidance? These two noble phantasms can be used to deal with this third Reikage. Neither Roy shook his head and chuckled, there are more than 8,000 flies around old man Reikage. Of course we must get rid of them together. More than 8,000 flies? Let's solve it together. Yuzu Maki Kashina on the side smacked her tongue secretly. Of course she knew that Roy who defeated Liu Ohao was definitely not weak and would not brag, but could a person really do such an exaggerated thing? You must know that Third Reikage is already a famous master in the ninja world. Even with such hard work, he only killed more than a thousand rock shinobi ninjas. However, although I felt deep down that Roy would definitely not be able to do it. Yuzu Maki Kashina still used the power belonging to Nine Tails Jinchuriki, and used Nine Tails Chakra to protect herself and Kasuma Gokushu. I remember Yuakai Hamadara had a move called Tengai Shinsai, and the one he hit at that time was the old man from Third Suchikage right? That old guy from Golden Lion also likes to hit people with islands. He's really cool. With divine power surging in his body, Roy loudly shouted out the spirit of the noble phantasm. Come, Leviathan, the dragon of chaos. J.A. Uh, the already astonishingly large bone dragon expanded rapidly at a speed visible to the naked eye. Even though Roy still hadn't fully unleashed the power of this noble phantasm, the terrifying air wave set off by the dragon's roar still swept hundreds of miles, causing a terrifying natural disaster like a tornado, crushing an unknown amount of land into ruins. Ah. My ears. Wind dot 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 wind style? Are you kidding? How could anyone use an ninjutsu on this scale? Help me. Help me quickly. Below, countless rock shinobi ninjas were deafened by the sudden roar, and many even had blood flowing in their ears. A large number of weaker ninjas were torn into pieces by the violent tornado, leaving pieces of flesh and blood all over the sky. The few powerful rock shinobi Jonin and Third Reikage were struggling to hold on under this terrifying storm, their eyes looking towards the sky in horror. The sun dot 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 is blocked. Looking at the huge skeletal monster soaring in the air like a continent, Third Reikage, who remained unafraid even when faced with the siege of 10,000 ninjas, tasted the taste of fear for the first time in his life. What shocked him even more was that in his sight, this behemoth, like a continent, seemed to be getting bigger and bigger. This thing is falling. Run. In the heartrending screams of one rock shinobi Jonin, more than 8,000 rock shinobi ninjas were instantly defeated and fled in all directions. But it was too late. Although it is still not completely liberated, Leviathan, the Dragon of Chaos, is still big enough to span more than a dozen islands, like a continent in the sky. Like a meteorite falling from the sky, it fell vertically, and finally hit the ninja continent hard. Boom. The deafening roar resounded throughout the entire ninja world, and even the continental plates trembled violently. Countless ninjas and civilians from all over the ninja world rushed out of their houses with horrified faces, thinking that a terrible earthquake had occurred. Even the people in the chat group who were watching the live broadcast seemed to feel the shock comparable to the collision of continental plates. Leviathan, the Dragon of Chaos, a monster that could crush the entire world just by turning over in its heyday, finally showed its amazing power for the first time in the world of Hokage. Chapter 38 I am the thunder that tears apart the stars, please remember to save it when you read it gentlemen. What dot 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 what is this? On the back of a bone dragon as wide as a continent, Yuzu Maki Kashina, who was wrapped in Nine Tails Chakra collapsed to the ground together with Kasuma Gokushu. The two women felt that the bones in their bodies had been shaken soft, and their eyes were full of fear and panic. The moment Leviathan fell from the sky and hit the ground, they almost thought the end of the world was coming. Yuzu Maki Kashina didn't know that the nine tails in her body was also trembling at this time. Are you kidding? Is this guy the same immortal as the old man from Six Paths? This is too scary. Nine tails huge body lay in the sealed space, curled up like an insecure pet dog its huge eyes full of fear. This is Yuzu Maki Kashina, the friend of this stinky girl? No. From now on, I must be honest and lend all my strength to this woman. Otherwise, if I offend this man named Roy, I'm afraid I will die without a burial place. At the same time, in the chat group, everyone was also frightened by Roy's terrifying blow. Yuakai Hamuki, wow. Did you make a mistake? I just said you are the protagonist, right? You are not in the same dimension as us at all. Yamamoto Genri Yuzai Karuha. Calm down. We haven't exploded the star yet. We haven't even sunk the continent. It's just that the visual effects look exaggerated. Yamamoto Genri Yuzai Karuha, but Miss Troy, it's been less than half a month since you got cheat, right? To be able to grow to this extent in such a short period of time, I have to say that your hand of Hermes is really worthy of me. In the name of God's left hand, asts, horrifying. I can't imagine how I would respond to this move. I guess even if I build an iceberg to defend myself, I will only be smashed into pulp. Sigura Tasuka. Brother Roy is so awesome. Kasuma Gokushu, indeed, I was scared to death. No one felt more deeply about how terrifying Roy's blow was than Kasuma Gokushu who was present at the scene. She also realized more clearly that if she didn't seize the time to improve herself, sooner or later she would not even be qualified to stand by Roy's side. In the future, she would only be able to see him in group live broadcasts. Yuakai Hamuki, 
So what kind of amazing noble phantasm has His Highness Roy obtained this time? Congratulations in advance. Can you please stop bullying me or stealing my wife from now on? Roy, at you Akihamuki. Don't worry, you can't escape from this beating. Roy, besides, who is your wife? Do you think Yuzu Maki Kashina cares about you now? Roy, by the way, I haven't obtained the noble phantasm yet. Yamamoto Genri Yuzai King U, huh? No way, asks, does this mean the third Reikage isn't dead yet? Roy, yes, this guy's life is really tough. Stopping the liberation of Leviathan, the Dragon of Chaos. Roy slowly landed on the land that was crushed into a basin and a rift. Everywhere he could see was dark red earth and white powder, these were the corpses of 10,000 rock shinobi ninjas. Not far away, the unrecognizable third Reikage was lying on the ground, with only the slight rise and fall of his chest proving his survival. Although it looks amazing, is it just a powerful impact in the end? The third Tsuchikage can withstand Yuakai Hamadara's Tengai Shinsai, and the third Reikage with stronger defense can withstand Leviathan's crash, which is normal. Dot. Walking in front of third Reikage, Roy sighed to himself, I don't know if the level 1 Leviathan can improve the level of the noble phantasm, and whether it can learn truly destructive moves, instead of just relying on physical combat. Dot. At this moment, the dead third Reikage suddenly opened his eyes. Who are you? Third Reikage stared at Roy and asked word for word. Nirona Roy Saint, a world noble from other world. He didn't dislike third Reikage. Roy smiled and said, Yuakaiha is a friend invited by Mickey. You dot 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 chaiha dot 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 it turns out dot 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 that's how it is. Third Reikage grinned with great effort, I dot 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 it's not a loss. Although I don't know why Konoa's Yuakaiha Mickey could invite such a terrifying monster, but he can die with 10,000 rock shinobi ninjas and protect the vitality of his village. Third Reikage is satisfied, as for the future fate of the village, that is not something that a dying man should consider. Under Roy's gaze, the ninja hero closed his eyes with satisfaction and stopped breathing. Then, a violent energy was pulled out of his body and poured into Roy's left arm. This is the legend belonging to the third Reikage. It was captured by Roy who killed him, and then combined with the divine power of the Hand of Hermes, he finally created a fantasy weapon unique to Roy alone. Its name is, I am the thunder that tears apart the stars. I am the thunder that tears apart the stars. Level, level 1. Category, anti-country noble phantasm, anti-star noble phantasm can grow. Usurping the legend of the third Reikage's life and combining it with the hand of Hermes to create the ultimate noble phantasm of thunder. Although the prototype is the star-destroying thunder from God Tears use, its potential is even better, but it is currently a bit immature. After the noble phantasm is released, the body will be integrated with the divine thunder, so it can also be regarded as a defensive noble phantasm of the same level. The noble phantasm can be released instantly, but if all the word spirits are recited, the power can be increased several times. Dot. He looks pretty strong, and he also has both defense and attack, just like the third Reikage himself. After looking at the information about the new noble phantasm, Roy was quite satisfied and sent it to the chat group. Roy, picture, Liu oh how, a new noble phantasm is here, Zeus? I don't know what the difference is with Zeus, the god of disobedience in my world. Yuakai Hamuki, I'll go. Isn't this the noble phantasm of Zeus? It's a noble phantasm that can actually destroy planets. Referee. I want to report someone here for cheating. Yamamoto Genri Yuzai Karuha, it's not that exaggerated. It's only an anti-national treasure at the moment. But it can also attack and defend at the same time. It's really suitable for Mr. Roy at this stage. Asts, this body and divine thunder fusion should be the same as the elementalization in the pirate world, right? Yuakai Hamuki, that's right. And it's a divine thunder. It will definitely not be caught by armament haki like thunder fruit. Yuakai Hamuki, damn it. It's so foul. At Nairona middle dot Roishing. You must let me see how powerful this treasure is in a while. Roy, no problem. Roy, just use you idiot to test the strength of this noble phantasm. Yuakai Hamuki, R. Tasukasura, poor Mickey's sister. Yamamoto Genri Yuzai King U, TSK who told you, a idiot like you, to constantly provoke Mr. Roy in the group? You can only say that it's your own fault. Yuakai Hamuki, no, that's the God King's noble phantasm. I will definitely be electrocuted alive. Yuakai Hamuki, at, sister, the leader. Please save me. I'm still young and don't want to die. I haven't even had sex with the girls yet. Liu Oh Hao, you have such a bad character. Liu Oh Hao, but I am also very interested in this noble phantasm. Roy, if you plan to liberate this noble phantasm in the future, please be sure to start the live broadcast of the chat group. Please. Chapter 39 Jibril and Erina Nakari. Yuakai Hamiki ran away. Having seen the brutal scene of Roy beating Liu Oh Hao, I know that even though Roy likes beauty very much, he will never be merciful when attacking women. Naturally, she didn't dare to stay. What if she was really shocked by the noble phantasm? What a joke. That's God Deer's use's divine thunder. This is not the lightning style of those useless people from Cloud Shinobi village. However, Liu Ohau took the initiative to ask for help, 
hoping to use the powerful diamond power to resist Roy's noble phantom and experience the power of the star-destroying divine thunder. But in the end, Roy didn't use his newly acquired noble phantasm on her. The main reason is that I'm afraid that if I don't control the intensity well, I'll electrocute her to death, which will be the worst for me, and I'll be kicked out of the chat group. Liu Ohao was naturally very disappointed by this, but he could also understand Roy's approach. By the way, you were run away by that little girl Yuakai Hamuki. Liu Ohao looked at Roy playfully, with less than three days left, even you will have a hard time finding her in the ninja world, right? Why should I look for her? Roy asked back. As a Chinese, don't you know that bullying the people she cares about will make her more sad than bullying herself? That's true, so you plan to bully dot 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 to. I know who it is. Liu Ohao was stunned for a moment while speaking and looked sideways at Yuzu Maki Kashina, who was hiding in the corner and sulking, with a hint of sympathy in his eyes. This is careless making of friends. Damn scumbag, I just made a careless friend. In the corner, Yuzu Maki Kashina was complaining about her best friend with a depressed look. That scumbag just wanted to be discovered by him in several boats, but now she actually ran away by herself, leaving her alone to these horrible guys. Although Mr. Roy and others should be good people rather than bad people. In short, Yuakai Hamiki, this scumbag is really irresponsible in every sense of the word. At this moment, a figure suddenly stood in front of her. Yuzu Maki Kashina subconsciously looked up and found Roy. Mr. Roy? Yuzu Maki Kashina looked at Roy with confusion. Yuakai Hamiki owes me this. Since you are her good friend, it's up to you to pay it back. As a celestial dragon, Roy certainly doesn't care about whether there is a right and wrong, and he doesn't care whether Yuzu Maki Kashina will be sad because of it. I saw him reaching out directly to grab Yuzu Maki Kashina's slender wrist, and then pinched her chin with his other hand forcing her to come closer to him. Well, the mouth is completely sealed. Looking at Roy who was almost face to face with him, tears fell from the corners of his eyes. Even though Roy looked completely in line with her own aesthetic, Yuzu Maki Kashina still felt extremely angry and humiliated at this time. But she was powerless to resist. Even Nine Tails, who had been very obedient until recently, seemed to have cut off the supply of power and stopped helping her. Scumbag, not far away, Xiazuki Ushi clenched his hands. Ruby-like eyes stared intently at the intimate Roy, he was obviously scolding Roy, but there was obvious envy and unwillingness in his tone. After a long time, the satisfied Roy finally let go of Yuzu Maki Kashina. Scum. Yuzu Maki Kashina, who had regained her freedom, cursed angrily with a red face, and ran away with a body flicker technique. Before leaving, she turned around and glared at Roy with her beautiful eyes. What a simple and cute little girl. Roy chuckled and wiped his mouth. Is this your revenge on your Kaihamuki? Liu Ohao on the side looked a little strange. How to say, even though she had guessed that Roy would do such a thing. She still didn't expect that he would actually do it. He is truly worthy of being a man who faces his own desires calmly, playing the role of a gentleman and being magnanimous. Of course it's not that simple. Roy smiled evilly and opened the chat group and posted the photo he had just taken. Roy, picture. Roy, at Yuakai Hamuki, you and Yuzu Maki Kashina haven't kissed yet, have you? Yuzu Maki Kashina's first kiss was not yours, Yuakai Hamuki's, but mine, Roy. Tasukasura. Brother Roy kissed sister Kashina from the Hokage world. Yamamoto Genri Yuzai whispered. BFFT, where did you come from Dio? Yamamoto Genri Yuzai whispered, by the way, this is a real piece of beef. That Yuakai idiot will definitely regret running away, right? Yuakai Hamuki, ah, uh, my Kashina. Yuakai Hamuki, how dare you bully such an innocent little cutie? Roy, you are so inhumane. Obviously, this time she was really fooled. Yuakai Hamuki even concealed the two words your highness that she most often used. At this point, Roy's goal has been achieved. To kill someone is to kill one's heart. He just wanted to bully Yuakai Hamuki and he didn't really have any grudge against her. So, it shouldn't be a problem for him to show off this Hokage time travel girl, right? Anyway, Lily is infinitely good, but it's a pity that she can't give birth. As a male friend, he provides free help, which is also a kind of humanistic care. Dot. Liu Ohao and Yuakai Hamiki attacked and destroyed Iwagakyo's lair. Roy attacked and killed the third Reikage and nearly 10,000 rock shinobi. When the news spread, all the forces in the ninja world were dumbfounded. Even the third ninja world war, which was originally going to be in full swing, was temporarily suspended because of this. All forces in the ninja world are in danger and are gathering their fighting strength like crazy. To prevent his hometown from suffering the same tragic blow as Iwagakyo, Konoa, Sarutobi Hiruzen, who had previously sworn that the information was false, smoked three pipes or cigarettes in a row with a depressed look. He almost burst his lungs, but he didn't understand where these monsters came from. But according to information from spies inside Iwagakyo, the woman who controls the Congo Rikishi is obviously an acquaintance of Yuakai Hamuki. The girl who has reproduced the terrifying power of Yuakai Hamadara, and the even more terrifying power, easily defeated the monster woman Uwagakyo. It is such a troubled time in the ninja world. Unable to resist smoking another pipe of cigarette, Sarutobi Hiruzen suddenly had the idea of retiring. Only, what about Namake's Minato, 
who is favored by him for the position of Hokage and is a disciple of Jiryu with a good background. Or what about Yua Kaihamuki, who has made great achievements and is now powerful in the ninja world? The third Hokage was lost in thought. Dot. Revenge Wagakyo's mission was completed perfectly. Let's just look at the final evaluation given by the chat group. Although Roy and others still had two days to stay in the Hokage world, they still chose to return directly. Retaliation Wagakyo mission completed. Kasuma Gokushu mission evaluation, passed, and received one Hokage world lottery opportunity. Liu Ohao's mission evaluation, excellent, obtained three Hokage world lottery opportunities. Nairona Roy Holy mission evaluation, excellent. Obtained three Hokage World Lottery opportunities. As the three people returned to their own world, the chat group prompt sounded immediately. Looking at the introduction, there are a total of four levels of task evaluation. They are unqualified, qualified, good, and excellent. And the rewards corresponding to these four levels range from zero to three draws. Roy and Liu Ohao obviously received the highest praise, and Kasuma Gokushu simply took advantage of Roy. Otherwise, if she has done nothing, she will most likely fail and receive no reward. I really want to thank Mr. World Noble, thinking that Roy not only protected himself in the Hokage world, but also allowed himself to receive rewards that he should not have received. Kasuma Gokushu couldn't help but feel a touch of tenderness in her eyes. But when the corner of her eye caught an intimate photo of Roy and Kashina, she couldn't help but snorted. He is truly a scumbag. Well, no matter what, let's say thank you in the group first. Kasuma Gokushu thought so. Sudden. Two prompts sounded again in the chat group. Wu Yifan joins the chat group. Jibril joins the chat group. Two new people joined the chat group in a row, immediately attracting the attention of all group members. But then the prompt sounded again. Group member Wu Yifan has died, and the chat group will randomly select a new member from the world where he is located to join. Erina Nakira joins the chat group. Underscore. Chapter 40 The Dead Male Protagonist Yuakai Hamuki, Miss Erina, Xiaoshi. Two beautiful girls again, great. Long live, Yuakai Hamuki. But what kind of unlucky guy is Wu Yifan? He died like this? Yamamoto Genryu's eye whispered, the person drawn from his world is Arina Nakiri. She is obviously from the Shokuki world, but I don't know if she is a time traveler or a native who did not appear in the original work. Tasakasura, poor, asks. The weak do not deserve mercy. I am more curious about whether the world of two newcomers is interesting. Yamamoto Genryu's eye whispered, Arina Nakiri is about the everyday world, may food. Yamamoto Genryu's eye whispered, Jibril's words are most likely from the game's life world, but I don't know whether the timeline is the main story or the theatrical version. Yuakai Hamuki, attests, if it were a theatrical version of the game world, it would definitely be your favorite world full of war, blood and carnage, Sister Queen. Yuakai Hamuki, but if it's the world of the main story dot 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 you probably won't like it, asks, does the world actually have two appearances? Nakiri Arena, excuse me dot 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 what's going on with this chat group? Nakiri Arena. Just now a strange man rushed towards me out of nowhere, shouting that the lady is so cute, etc. He was shot to death by my bodyguard, and then this chat group appeared in my mind. Dot. Nakiri Arena, all the worlds. Dot 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 is this true? Isn't it a prank? Yuakai Hamuki colon dot 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 shooting to death? Am I looking at a fake shock Hoji spirit? Yuakai Hamuki, but it seems that he must be an unlucky time traveler. Well, don't worry about it. Yuakai Hamuki. If you are curious, you can go and read the group announcement. If you still don't understand after reading it, you can ask us in the group. Nakiri Arena, okay, thank you. Dot. The world of Shoji. The frightened Nakiri Arena received reports from several bodyguards at home. After calling the police, the police told her that the strange man who suddenly rushed towards her was actually a gangster, and they could not investigate how he appeared there, and he was not even caught on surveillance. Is it really the so-called time traveler? Nakiri Arena clicked into the chat group announcement area curiously, and her eyes suddenly widened. The world of pirates, the world of Hokage, the world of Shinigami, noble phantasm, power, god killer, and a copy of the memory of my world? He opened the memory copy in confusion. Looking at the familiar figure appearing on the screen, Nakiri Arena was shocked again. Mr. Seichiro Saber. Dot. Game Life World, different from Nakiri Arena. After being pulled into the chat group, Jibril was quickly browsing through all the information and intelligence in the group. Even her copy of the memory has been read long ago. The God of War Arthosama and I are just characters in a light novel. Lord Artish, the God of War, was actually killed by a robot. A mere inferior human being can actually use the Star Cup to transform the world and turn it into a game world where people can't kill people wantonly. I don't want to. What's the point of a bad world where people don't kill people? That's right. Although the world is also very interesting. The world that belongs to me cannot be thrown away. What? I actually lost to two humans in the future. Appearing like a harmless and beautiful girl and angel, Jibril floats in midair, 
watching the information about other worlds in amazement. Finally, her eyes were fixed on Loy's name. The world noble who has usurped the legend of the strong possesses the noble phantasm of God. He is most likely the strongest person in the group right now. I don't know how he can compare with me. Well, anyway, let's kill that annoying male protagonist first, and then go say hello to the group. Dot. Jabril, as you may have guessed, I am Jabril. The extra individual in the game's life world. The timeline is before the male and female protagonists of the movie have met. Jabril. But these two will never meet again, picture. In the picture posted by Jabril, it was a cave that was blown into ruins. It can still be vaguely seen that it looked like someone had lived there. It's obvious. It only takes a few seconds. Jibril has found the male protagonist in the movie and killed him completely. Yuakai Homiki colon dot 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 It's exactly the same as the one depicted in the original work, ruthless and eager for war. Asts, very good. Very interesting. I feel like you would be a good target to ravage. Jibril, stop talking nonsense human woman. The Fluggles like us are a race capable of killing gods. Jabril, even the powerful humans from other world can never be the opponent of the Fluggles like us. Tasakasura, kill dot 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 kill god. How terrifying. Liu oh how, oh, how dare you call yourself the god killer. Then I can't ignore it. Liu oh how, we are also those who kill gods and usurp their power. Don't underestimate humans. Fluggle girl. Jabril, Humphrey, I'm much older than you. Besides, We'll know who is stronger and weaker if we find a chance to have a fight in the future. There is no point in a war of words. Liu oh how? I'm looking forward to that day. Nakiri Arena colon dot 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 the newcomer is shivering. Dot. The world of Shoji. Nakiri Arena was really trembling. The Nakiri clan is considered the overlord in Japan, so she has naturally seen a lot of dark sides. Not to mention anything else. Not long ago her bodyguard shot and killed a person who was suspected of trying to attack her. But dot 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 what are these? Looking at the pictures posted by Jabril. Arena Nakiri could not hide the fear on her face. That must be a place where a human race lives, right? The tribe's residence was bombed into rubble, and the fate of the humans among them can be imagined. And no one in the group came forward to accuse this. Are these guys all devils? Question mark. Chapter 41 Jibril. Fairy Beans? Nice one. As a character from the daily series, it is normal for Nakiri Arena to be shocked by the views of everyone in the chat group. After all, she is just an ordinary human being who can easily empathize. But for Oi et al, what is a human being? They are just weak people who are qualified to worship strong people like us. They are not heroes, nor is it the embodiment of justice, but a strong person who is loyal to his own desires. Even Kasuma Gokushiu, a girl who also comes from the daily series, has sign of being assimilated by Roy and others. If Nakiri Arena continues to be unable to accept this, no one in the chat group will do anything to her. But cold violence and exclusion are inevitable. Fortunately, Nakiri Arena still has a brain. She did not post her emotions in the chat group. Although the time was short, Arena Nakiri, the eldest lady of the Nakiri clan, had already realized that the chat group was her opportunity. Dot. Yuakai Hamuki, speaking of which, have you received your newcomer rewards, Jibril? Is this it? Picture. What Jibril sent was the reward she had just drawn from the chat group. Fairy bin making. Function. Collect the corpses of strong men and use this prop to make fairy bins in batches. Fairy bins are a magical food and eating one can instantly heal any injury, but it has no effect on disease. Yuakai Hamuki, Senzu Bins. They are actually Senzu Bins. And they can be made. Yamamoto Genri I whispered, what a good luck. For people who often fight, this is really a rare treasure. Asts, can it actually heal all injuries? Kasuma Gokushu, terrible effect. Liu oh how, doesn't this mean that as long as you don't get killed instantly, you can have countless lives? Roy, that's right. Roy, and the most buggy thing is that what Jabril got was not a few fairy beans. But the ability to make fairy beans, Jabril. Hey, it seems I'm very lucky, Jabril. At Nairona Middle. Roishing, you should be the strongest person in the chat group, right? Do you want to find a chance to make a date, Roy? Okay, Roy, whose self confidence continues to grow, will naturally not refuse Jabril's invitation to fight. Jabril, happy people like you like this, Yuakai Hamuki. Ah, uh, why do you keep thinking about fighting every day, Jabril? A pretty girl like you should stick with me, Jabril. Huh? Jabril, is this a confession? I'm sorry. A weak confession is an insult to me. Yuakai Hamuki. You 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 I'm looked down upon. But for the sake of your fragrant and soft body Jibril Chan, I will definitely work harder. Jibril colon dot 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 okay, come on, dot. Game life world. Jibril shivered inexplicably. How scary that I actually met a lesbian. At the same time, the world of Shoji, following the prompts from the chat group, Erina Nakiri also entered the lottery. This is, looking at the Chinese little master recipe placed in front of her. A look of surprise flashed in Nakiri Arena's eyes. As a chef, what she desires is naturally not strength, but delicious food, rare ingredients and excellent cooking skills. It can be said, the reward drawn from the chat group was exactly what she wanted. Nakiri Arena, who was in a very happy mood, even temporarily forgot about the shock just now, and conveniently sent the reward she received to the group. Nakiri Arena, picture, Nakiri Arena, hello everyone, 
I'm just an ordinary chef with no special abilities. Yuakai Hamuki, it's Miss Arena. Tsn't ear never goes out of style. Ah, I'm dead. Nakiri Arena colon dot 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 hello. Yamamoto Jenryu's I whispered, that's enough, you idiot. Didn't Mr. Roy teach you enough lessons in the Hokage world? Yamamoto Jenryu's I whispered, at Akari Arena, don't worry about this idiot. She is just an idiot female time traveler who wants to open a harem. I guess you are also one of the anime characters she liked in her previous life. Nakiri Arena, oh dot 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 okay. Although I already knew from the memory copy that the world I was in was just a comic. But Arena still felt very novel when meeting someone who knew her. Is this the so-called time traveler? And as Nakiri Arena took the initiative to say hello, everyone in the group had a good attitude towards her. Even Asts, who always looked down on the weak, took the initiative to reply with a greeting. After all. We are all group friends. Friendly and mutual help is the main tone in the group. Except Jibril. This fluggle girl who joined the chat group with Nakiri Arena could be said to have a worse nature than anyone else in the group. But no one cared. Wasn't the leader you oh how very arrogant before? After being almost killed by Roy in the Hokage world. His personality has become much more friendly now. The truth is only within range. Girls with bad personalities need to be educated well. Although they didn't say it out loud. Many people in the group were actually looking forward to the meeting between Roy and Jibril. I think Jibril will become a lot friendlier when the time comes, right? Dot. Pirate World, exit the chat group. Roy slowly walked out of his vault. Four or five days have passed since I traveled to the world of Hokage, and less than one day has passed in the world of pirates. Stussy and Ake Aina have taken the marine fleet to South Blue to carry out the mission assigned to them by Roy. One Piece's wife. I will take good care of her. Recalling the cute and innocent look of Rouge in the original novel, Roy had an evil smile on his face. He then pulled out a bug phone and called the five elders. I want the devil fruit created by Vegapunk using Kaido. I know it's a failure, but it's enough for slaves to eat, as long as it looks good. This is not a request, but an order. Hurry up. Completely ignoring the dissatisfaction of the five elders, Roy's tone seemed to be ordering his subordinates. I understand. Let someone get it for you. The kind old man Sartain was so angry that he suppressed his resentment and asked, What not can you matter? When do you plan to go? Your Highness Roy. After Operation South Blue is over. Roy smiled casually. If I don't take care of my good brother Roger's wife first, I'll have a bad conscience. Five elders. I just can't complain. Let's sympathize with Roger, the Pirate King. Meeting His Highness Roy was the greatest misfortune in his life. Chapter 42 Eternal Mange Kyo Sharingan. Please provide data thank you. A few days passed in the blink of an eye. In addition to living normally in their own world, everyone in the chat group spends almost all the rest of their time in the chat group. It can be seen with the naked eye that the relationship between the group members has improved a lot. Even Jibril, who was not very popular at the beginning, has eased her relationship with others a lot. I can't help it, the fairy bends are so fragrant. As a fluggle that can kill gods, Jibril, the extra individual, is one of the strongest individuals in the tribe. Her character is very warlike so she naturally has no shortage of corpses of strong men. So in just a few days, she made hundreds of fairy beans, and one person in the group made one rich woman, hungry. Even for Kasuma Gokushi who lives in the daily world, Sanzu is undoubtedly a second life. Under such an irresistible temptation, even though Jibril's character is still terrible, everyone's favorable impression of her is slowly rising. Although she has a bad personality and likes to kill other races everywhere, but she is very kind to us and is a kind and good child. Dot. This day, Roy was playing with the artificial devil fruit sent from Vegapunk and looking through the information sent to him by Stussy and Ake Ainu, with a marine fleet comparable in size to Buster Call. In just a few days, the South Blue Pirates were severely wounded by Ake Ainu. Meanwhile Ake Ainu has searched dozens of islands and captured hundreds of pregnant women, but no woman suspected to be the wife of One Piece Roger was found. Ake Ainu didn't know. Roy had already told Stussy where Rouge was hiding and the latter kept him under surveillance. Now Portka's de Rouge is in a state of extreme anxiety and uneasiness. She was afraid that Marine would catch her and kill the child in her belly. I felt guilty for those innocent pregnant women caught by Ake Ainu, and spent every day in repentance. Although it is refreshing to take something by force, forcing a good girl to become a girl is also one of the joys of life. Roy stood up and stretched. It felt like it was almost time, and he was going to go to South Blue himself. After solving Rouge's matter, he can consider going to Wanokini. He didn't forget that he still had an opportunity to release a mission related to Wanokini. I don't know which three group members will randomly come to the pirate world in this chat group. Huh? Chat group mission. Roy suddenly froze on the spot, and then quickly entered the chat group. Roy, did we forget to use the number of draws we got from completing the mission? Retaliation against a Wagakure. Yuakai Hamuki. Liu oh ha? Well, I did forget it. Kasuma Goka Shiha, at that time, two newcomers, Chibril and Darina Nakiri, happened to join the group and my attention was completely drawn away. Asts, then let's get started, I'm very curious about what kind of rewards you will get. Kasuma Gokushu, okay. Without hesitation, 
Kasuma Gokushi used up one of his lucky draw opportunities. Congratulations to group member Kasuma Gokushi U for drawing Eternal Mange Kyo Sharingan. Randomly obtained the pupil technique. Kamui, Yamamoto Genri Yuzi I whispered, holy crap, what kind of luck is this? Asts. The eternal eye that is one level higher than Yukai Hamiki's Mange Kyo Sharingan. Yukai Hamiki, that's awesome. God does favor beauties, and the random pupil technique I got is Yukai Hobito's Kamui, which is both offensive and defensive. Yukai Hamiki. Kamu is a time and space pupil technique. It can not only distort the enemy to cause damage, but also suck yourself into the Kamu hollow to avoid damage. Damn it, I want Kamu so much. Jibril, time and space pupil technique. It sounds pretty powerful, but I don't know how it compares to my space ability. Liu Oh How, congratulations, little girl. Now you finally have some ability to protect yourself. Tasakasura, congratulations to Shibasama. Nakiri Arena, congratulations. Kasuma Gokushu, thank you everyone especially Master Liu Ohau and Mr. World Noble. If it weren't for you two, I wouldn't have been able to get the mission reward. Kasuma Gokushu, anyway dot 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 thank you so much. Dot. Eternal Mange Kyo Sharingan. Compared to regular Mange Kyo Sharingan, it consumes less and has no risk of blindness. It can also use the complete Suzu, which is even more powerful. Even looking at the entire Hokage world, these are definitely a pair of precious eyes. Everyday world. Kasuma Gokushu stood in front of the mirror and observed her eyes. The eyes that were originally as delicate as rubies were now even more gorgeous. Coupled with the unique pattern of Mange Kyo Sharingan, it adds a bit of strange beauty out of thin air. Regardless of whether he is strong or not, his appearance has really improved a bit. Kamui. When she got these eyes, she already knew how to use the ability. Kasuma Gokushu tried to suck the debris in front of her into the alien space. Of course it worked. But as the space twisted and deformed, Kasuma Gokushu immediately felt a sense of powerlessness coming from her body. As soon as his legs softened, he sat down on the ground. I don't have chakra, so I waste my energy. Feeling the powerlessness of his body, Kasuma Gokushu smiled bitterly. Unlike most people in the chat group, although he has the unreasonable ability to stop time, but she herself is just an ordinary female high school student with little exercise. Naturally, her physical strength was completely lacking, and she was completely exhausted after just using the pupil technique. It seems we can only expect the devil fruit that Mr. World Nobleman mentioned before. Thinking of the powerful and beautiful ability that Troy told him in the Hokage world, Kasuma Gokushu's cheeks turned red. After all, after all, she is not a strong woman and she has a little crush on Roy. Naturally, she won't be shy about Roy's help. Dot. In the chat group, Kasuma Gokushu won the grand prize in a lottery, which made the atmosphere in the group much more lively. Liu Oha, very good. Next is me, let you see the luck of the god killer. Liu Oha, who has always been confident in his own luck, is also preparing to start the lottery. Although most of the abilities in the Hokage world are of no use to her, but she is the god killer. He is a lucky person favored by god. I think she will definitely be able to get a pair of mange kyo sharingan or even the Renegan Intensigan that Yuakai Hamiki mentioned, right? Then, congratulations to group member Liu Ohau for drawing fire style middle dot great fireball technique. Congratulations to group member Liu Ohau for drawing water style middle dot water dragon bomb technique. Congratulations to group member Liu Ohau for drawing earth style middle dot earth dragon bullet. Liu Ohau, when I send out a bunch of question marks, it means it's not me who has the problem, but you. Your chat group is probably targeting me, the god killer, question mark. Chapter 43 Roy finally lasted. Please collect tilde. Yuakai Hamuki, PFFT, Yuakai Hamuki, sorry, sister leader, although I know I shouldn't laugh, I really can't help it. Yamamoto Genri Yuzai whispered. The three powerful ninjutsu are actually not low, but they are of no use to the god killer. This luck, Jabril. Oh, is this the god killer? He is really embarrassed. If we were fluggles, we would definitely not have drawn such a low-level thing. Tasakasura, I feel sorry for sister Liuoha. Liuoha, hey. No matter how low level the ninjutsu is, as long as I use it, it will still be astonishingly powerful. Liu Ohau once again proved with facts that she is an African. Combined with the strengthening the furnace ability she obtained in the chat group, she has overturned countless times in terms of luck. Fortunately, everyone in the chat group was basically making fun of her, and no one really ridiculed her. But Liu Ohau still blushed a little. She truly believed from the bottom of her heart that the godslayer should be very lucky. However, the reality is completely different from what she thought. No. I have to use a backrest, she can't be the only one with bad luck. So Liu Ohau was in the group at Roy, are you planning to smoke now? Roy, yeah. To be honest, in the entire Hokage world, there are only a few top level abilities that interest Roy. For example, the abilities of the Rinnegan, Tensigan, and Otsutsuki clan. If you can get the best one, that's the icing on the cake. It doesn't matter if you can't draw it. Anyway, he relies on his noble phantasm to make a living so he has no shortage of powerful abilities. Congratulations to group member Nirona Roy for drawing, 8 Inner Gates Formation. Congratulations to group member Nirona Roy for drawing, 
Sanju Clan Sage Body. Congratulations to group member Nirona Roy for drawing Sanju Clan Sage Body. Because two identical rewards were drawn, the rewards were merged. Congratulations to group member Nirona Roy for obtaining Sanju Clan Sage Body. Enhanced version. Yamamoto Genryu's I whispered, holy shit. Kasuma Gokushu. Ah, sage body quality. It sounds like something very powerful. Asts, it looks like you're getting stronger again. Yuakai Hamuki, I'll go. This is unscientific. Yuakai Hamuki. The eight inner gates are just that, they are of little use to you, but there is actually an enhanced version of the sage body. Yuakai Hamuki, even if I just get the ordinary version of the Sanju clan's sage body, I can immediately soar into the sky and defeat all dissenters in the entire ninja world. Liu Oha, this luck, I'm going to be autistic. Liu Oha, however, it seems that Roy can finally escape the embarrassing situation of insufficient physical strength. This is something worth celebrating. Roy colon dot 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 so being too weak has completely become my dark history. Tasakasura, congratulations to brother Roy. Brother Roy can finally release the noble phantasm at will. Jabril, BFFT, so your weakness is your lack of endurance? Roy had a dark look on his face. Whether my endurance is enough or not, you will understand when we have a fight in the future. Chicken, Jabril, HMPH. That's really exciting to watch. I guess your blood must be extremely sweet, right, Jabril? Don't worry, I will prepare 100 fairy bins for you when the time comes, which will not only let you feel the excitement of the battle, but also keep you unscathed. Nakiri Arena, Nakiri Arena. Actually, I always feel that you are in love, not fighting. Dot. Roy discovered. I actually quite like girls like you, Akai Hamiki and Jabril who love to quarrel with me. Very energetic and not obnoxious. Certainly, this does not conflict with the fact that they should receive education about their own love. As for what exactly is the education of love, whatever Liu Hao has experienced in the Hokage world. Eight inner gates formation dot 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 is really useless. After exiting the chat group, Roy casually looked at the three dot 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 two rewards he had drawn. First of all, Eight inner gates formation is really useless, because Roy has the noble phantasm Hercules belt, as long as he releases the noble phantasm. His strength and speed will definitely crush his enemies. Isn't this better than the eight inner gates formation that damages the body? Of course, there are many skills without being overwhelming. What's more, he also got an enhanced version of the Senju clan sage body, which happened to be immune to the side effects of the eight inner gates. It should be automatically integrated after receiving it, right? After receiving the two rewards together, an extremely amazing breath of life suddenly emerged from Roy's body. Under the influence of this breath of life, a lush forest instantly grew inside his palace, almost breaking the ceiling of the palace. What a terrifying vitality! Feeling the overflowing life energy in his body, Roy's face was filled with surprise. After integrating this enhanced version of Sage Body, a conservative estimate is that his physical strength has increased by as much as 20 or 30 times. Minor injuries can be healed instantly and even broken limbs can probably grow back in a short time. Even the natural energy in the air continued to penetrate into his body. Even if he doesn't take the initiative to practice, he feels that his body is getting stronger little by little. Zhang, with a thought, Roy's right arm turned into darkness, like a layer of armor. Armament Haki himself awakens. This reward is worth it, it's a real profit. Let's go. In high spirits, Roy got on the luxury ship exclusive to the Dragon People and set off for South Blue. On the way, Roy made three phone calls. The first call was to Akei Ainu asking him to try his best to prevent Pluton Rayleigh and Garp from entering the South Blue Waters. The second one called Stussy and asked her to continue monitoring Roger's wife, Rouge. The third call was to Morgans, telling him that he was going to conduct a worldwide live broadcast and had big news. Roy Saint, may I venture to ask what the big news is? Although one of his newsbirds was killed by Roy before, Morgan's attitude towards Roy was still very respectful. Certainly, Roy, who was in a very happy mood, did not refuse and asked instead, you know Marine is searching for One Piece Roger's pregnant wife in South Blue, right? No, Morgans nodded. Marine has made such a big fuss, and the whole world knows about it. It is said that even the Golden Lion is coming to South Blue. Golden Lion? It doesn't matter, it's just a small role. Anyway, this is what I want to live broadcast. Taking the cold juice from the maid next to him, Roy's voice gradually became colder. I got a small toy and I plan to test how powerful this toy is. Podcast D. Rouge just happened to catch up. As long as she doesn't take the initiative to stand up and kneel at my feet. I will completely wipe an island in South Blue off the map until she takes the initiative to stand up. I want the whole world to know that being a pirate will not end well. No matter how prosperous you are, I will kill you without mercy and then bully your wife and children. Just because this world doesn't need any bullshit pirate king, it only needs the only master, Saint Nerona Roy, the Celestial Dragon. Chapter 44 I'm going to have a tan long grandson-in-law. After hanging out the phone, Morgans was frightened by Roy. Toy, wipe the island off the map. Is this Saint Roy talking about Marine Buster Call? He's crazy. You know, no matter how many enemies Roger had during his lifetime, everything Roy did was to provoke the pirates. That's not just one or two people, 
but a declaration of war on countless pirates around the world. But after the shock, there was ecstasy. This is undoubtedly huge news that can shock the world. Therefore, Morgans immediately mobilized all the authority he could mobilize in his life, just to be able to prepare for this worldwide live broadcast in the shortest possible time. Dot. Ding. Congratulations on getting an opportunity to publish a world mission. Please check the mission and then choose whether to publish the mission to the chat group. After hanging up the phone from Morgans, the chat group notification suddenly sounded in Roy's ears. Another mission? Roy was a little surprised. You know, his last three-person mission about Wanokini has not been released yet. Enter the chat group. Roy clicked on the task to view it. Mission name. Preventing the rescue of Portka's de Rouge. Mission goal. Because of friendship, hatred and commitment. Rayleigh. Golden Lion and Garp do not want you to take away Roger's wife. Please capture Portka's de Rouge under their obstruction. Task period. Seven days. The task will fail after seven days. Task reward. After the task is completed, the chat group will rate each task member separately. Distribute the number of draws, and the prize pool will be all the specialties owned by the pirate world. Task members, three people, randomly selected from the group, Rayleigh, Garp, and Golden Lion. Was it me that caused the butterfly effect? Roy smiled playfully, feeling that things had become a lot more interesting. Unlike the previous one Okuni mission, this time he directly posted the mission in the chat group. St. Nirona Roy has released a world mission and three mission members will be randomly selected. The sudden notification sound shocked all members of the chat group. Yuakai Hamuki, huh? Your Highness Roy can actually issue missions? Tasuka Sura, Capture Rouge. It's the wife of the former pirate King Roger. Nakiri Arena, arresting a wife? And a pregnant wife? You, you, you. Isn't this too immoral? Asts, it doesn't matter who you catch. That Garp, Golden Lion and Rayleigh should be the strongest in the pirate world, right? Asts. You must get me this time. The revolutionary army in my world is not enough for me. Yamamoto Genri I whispered, I am also a little interested. Devil fruit in one piece world still has great potential, especially some of the abilities that can be called bugs. If you can draw it, you will make money. Liu Oha, I don't have much time this time. Liu Oha, I'm thinking of ways to unlock Sun Wukong's seal in advance, kill him, and seize his power. Maybe I can also issue a world mission by then. Yuakai Hamuki, huh? Sister leader. Your plot is already so late, Liu Oha. No, the so-called male protagonist hasn't become as god killer yet. I just plan to act in advance. Yamamoto Genri I whispered, Sun Wukong. Dot 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 a monster that can even avoid light speed attacks. Master Liu Oha must be careful. Liu Oha. Don't worry, we and the God Slayers will definitely not fail. Not to mention that there may be help from our friends. Ding. The chat group prompt interrupted everyone's chat. Congratulations to Yamamoto Genri Uzai Kinu, Ace Des and Nakiri Arena for getting the opportunity to participate in this world mission. Asts, okay, it's finally my turn this time. Yamamoto Genri I whispered, is this still me? Yes, I am still very interested in Devil Fruit. Jabril, hey, don't you have me? I'm bored. I'm going to continue hunting down my prey and making fairy beans. Nakiri Arena, eh? Why are you still here with me? Nakiri Arena, I don't have any fighting ability. I can only cook. What should I do when I travel to other world? Roy. Dot 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 be my personal little cook. Yuakai Hamuki, shocked. The scumbag started hooking up with girls again. Roy, Humphrey, at least I didn't hide my feet and ride on many boats like you, right? You irresponsible scumbag. Yuakai Hamuki, I dot 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 I'm a scumbag secretly, you are a scumbag openly, everyone is obviously the same. Roy, your wife's first kiss was mine. Yuakai Hamuki, R, you bastard. Roy, your wife is awesome. You are Kai Hamiki colon dot 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 you 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 I won't talk to you anymore. I'm so angry. Tasuka Sura. Yamamoto Genri I whispered. This idiot finally met someone who can deal with her. Nakiri Arena. Dot. The world of Shoji. A touch of Rosie appeared on Nakiri Arena's porcelain white face. She has been a popular young lady since she was born. This was the first time in her life that someone had said such ambiguous words to her. What is a personal little cook? That world noble Saint Roy wouldn't think of himself as his maids. Ah. What should I do? I'm going to other world. Do I still have to stay with that celestial dragon? Thinking of the great achievements she had seen about Roy and the group, Arena Nakiri felt her body getting hot. She seems to be arrogant and unreasonable. But actually she likes reading romance comics. I have even started simulating various secret plays in my mind. In the chat group. Naturally, no one knew what Nakiri Arena was thinking. Asts, who had long been eager to go to other world, spoke directly. I'm ready. Yamamoto Genri Uzai Shijikuni, I'm ready to. Yuakai Hamuki, Atakari Arena. The three of them will start traveling as soon as they are ready. If you want to take anything with you, be sure to pick it up in advance. Nakiri Arena. Can I still refuse now? She has already fantasized about being ravaged by Roy in other world, and she really doesn't dare to go. Yuakai Hamuki, it's a pity that it can't be done. Yuakai Hamuki, even if you refuse, you will be forced to time travel after the chat group. Nakiri Arena, 
Okay, he sighed helplessly and cleared his mind of the messy and unclean contents. Naked Arena went to her grandfather and asked for a pistol. Arena, what do you want with this? The muscular old man Naked Sanzim and looked at his lovely granddaughter in surprise. He really couldn't connect Naked Arena with things like guns. I got an opportunity. After hesitating for a moment, Naked Arena whispered, Maybe I can travel to Otherworld. Then with a thought in her mind, the pistol disappeared out of thin air and was included in the chat group. Nakiri Sensimon's eyes shrank, and he was extremely shocked. Is such that, not intending to hide her relatives, Nakiri Arena told her grandfather some information in the chat group. Heroic spirits, Shinigami, ninjas, and the world's nobles, the celestial dragons. Listening to these terms that symbolized powerful power, Nakiri Sensimon felt for the first time the insignificance of himself and the world. Finally, Commander Yuanayu sighed deeply. If that celestial dragon Saint Roy wants to get you, it's best not to resist him. Looking at Nakiri Arena's cheeks that instantly turned rosy, Nakiri Sensimon said solemnly, Since you said you will be kicked out of the chat group only if you kill group members, then obviously torture, slavery, and disability are allowed. In front of such a strong man, I'm afraid even the entire Nakiri clan and even Japan are nothing more than chickens and dogs. No matter how important a clean body is, you have to know how to choose. Do you understand what I mean, little Arena? Um, her rosy face turned slightly pale, and it was obvious that Nakiri Arena had also thought of the possibility of Roy being unusually cruel. But she had no choice. Nakiri Arena, I'm ready. With her speech in the group, the One Piece World mission officially began. Buzz, under the gaze of Nakiri Sensimon. Arena disappeared into the dazzling golden light. I hope Arena can turn the situation around. She is a kind and good child and should not have to suffer those difficulties. Clenching his fists, Nakari Sanzimon muttered to himself helplessly, but think on the bright side, if that world noble Saint Roy is not that bad, maybe little Arena can be brought back to me. Maybe a grandson-in-law from Mother World. Chapter 45 Unwise Asts, a luxurious ship exclusive to the Celestial Dragons. Roy had already ordered everyone to get off and there was no one on the deck except him. A golden light flashed. Three distinctive figures appeared in front of Roy. The leading woman is about 1.8 meters tall, with long black hair hanging down to her waist, and a very delicate face that exudes a heroic spirit. She was wearing a black inner shirt, a white feather fabric, and a long sword on her waist. She was dressed very simply. He looks like a wandering swordsman. Yamamoto Genryu Zaikini, a female time traveler from the Shinigami world. The ability she gained in the chat group is, direct death and Zanpei Kuto's ability is unknown, so her strength should not be underestimated. The other two were very familiar to Roy. Ice Queen Asts wears a white military uniform and high boots, with long blue hair hanging down to her calves. And there is the beautiful girl Erino Nakiri with beautiful blonde hair, wearing a JK uniform and silk stockings. Is this other world? And this man is Roy. Nakiri Arena, who had never watched the live broadcast, saw Roy for the first time, and was secretly looking at him from the corner of her eye. She blushed as she looked at it. Thinking of his previous messy thoughts and his grandfather's instructions, he lowered his head shyly. Ha! Ah. The air in the pirate world is really good, and the energy fluctuations seem to be much stronger than in my world. Breathing the fresh air of the sea, Asts looked at Roy with her warlike eyes. Do you want to have a fight with me first? There is no need to rush in the battle. Yamamoto Genryu's eye calmly stopped Asts, a fighting maniac, with his soft words. Then she looked sideways at Roy and asked curiously going to such great lengths for a portkas de rouge, isn't that right? Of course, even if that woman is Roger's wife, she won't let me use such a big scene. Roy had a gentle smile on his face, testing the strength of the new noble phantasm, seizing the legend of the golden lion to create a new noble phantasm, and announcing my arrival to the whole world. I can only say that this woman rouge is lucky. It's relatively bad, just in time. Is that so? Dot 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 I understand. Yamamoto Genryu's I nodded softly. She did not accuse Roy of disrespecting women and having crazy ideas that would destroy the lives of South Blue. She is also a member of the noble class in Sirite. After enjoying the life of a master, it is really difficult for her to empathize with ordinary people. Not to mention Asts, in her eyes. The weak are not even human beings, they are just exploited pigs, regardless of gender. Huh? It seems that Asts is a staunch supporter of gender equality. Even the little girl Larina Nakiri, who was listening in, had somewhat figured it out at this time, although Roy's behavior does seem a bit cruel. But if you think about it carefully, isn't it the same in her own world? With her god's tongue, just one sentence can deny a chef decades of hard work and completely destroy their life. This kind of naked arena is certainly not as cruel as Roy, who carelessly disregards human life. But they both destroy other people's lives, so what's the essential difference between the two? Happy. It turns out that everyone is a bad person. It's really not a family, if you don't enter the same family. Dot. After figuring out that she was not a good person, Nakiri Arena felt much more relaxed. Even when Roy asked her to be his personal cook, he didn't resist it that much, even a little bit enjoying it. After all, 
Among other things, there are countless strange animals and sea kings in the pirate world. Just a few days, Erina saw hundreds of new ingredients that she had never heard of before, and was completely immersed in the beauty of other world. Dot. Under the sun, Roy and his group were lying on the deck chairs and basking in the sun comfortably. It'll be south blue soon, Roy said happily while enjoying the delicious desserts made by Arena. Is it finally here? I can't wait. Ast crossed her long legs and looked at Roy with her ice-like eyes. Before we start, do you want to warm up your lower body first? Roy frowned slightly. This is the second time you've invited me. Do you really want to be beaten? Well, Ast is a fighting maniac. After all, Yamamoto Genryu's eye whispered and stared at Roy with the same fighting spirit as the fastest Shinigami in Seoul society, even Yoruichi, who is known as the Flash Goddess, is no match for me, so I also want to experience your Hercules the magic of the belt, is that so? Okay, he stood up helplessly and pulled the confused Arena Nakiri behind him, Roy stretched lazily and asked, want to start a live broadcast? I'm okay, Asts does not reject live broadcasts, it doesn't matter whether he wins or loses, group member Astes starts live broadcast, Yuakai Hamuki, huh? I thought the mission had started, what is this going to do, Liu Oha? It's obvious that we're going to fight, but I don't know if it's 1v1 or a group fight. Jabril, oh, finally getting to see the battle in other world? It's really exciting. Kasuma Goka Shiha, ah, Mr. World Nobleman is really considerate. Has he protected Miss Arena behind him? Chatting people entered the group live broadcast, and most of them were full of interest in the battle that was about to begin. However, Kasuma Goka Shu's tone was a bit strange, as if a little girl was jealous. Dot. I'll go first. The Ice Queen, who had long been unable to hold back could not hide the excited expression on her face, and a biting cold air was released from her whole body. Mokabatomo, with no intention of fighting Roy, and no intention of showing mercy, Asts started with a strong start. Kaka Kaka, biting ice seemed to fill the entire world in an instant, and the sea turned into an endless ice field. Even the moisture in the air was frozen, forming densely packed beautiful crystals. Everything in the world is like entering a completely still and strange other world. Cool. Asts exhaled a breath of cold air and looked at Roy and others who looked like ice sculptures in this world of ice and snow. Time and space were successfully frozen. Asts was a little confused. Obviously he didn't expect it to be so easy. To be honest, even though she has the power of God of War, she has been strengthened in all aspects several times, and her strength has already surpassed her original self. But Asts never thought that he could easily freeze Roy's time and space. Everyone in the chat group was also very surprised. Yuakai Hamuki, no way, could it be that the ability to restrain His Highness Roy is something like stopping time? Shikasu Magoka, it's possible that I successfully stopped time in the Hokage world, and neither the world's nobles nor the leader Liu Oha were immune. Sura Tataka, Brother Roy, Jabril, Humphrey, this woman playing with ice was fooled. What she froze was not Roy at all, but an afterimage. What? Noticing Jabril's words in the chat group. Ast's A's narrowed and he reacted instantly. Roy actually took a similar response to the red pupil in her copy of memory. Damn, you were so careless. You've learned a lesson from your mistakes, Ast's. Roy's careless voice sounded from behind, and strange blue steam lingered around him. Then there was a heavy punch that roared with strong winds and distorted the air. With a blessing of the Hercules belt, Roy's speed and strength will definitely crush Ast's. In addition, Roy's body had been strengthened by the enhanced version of Sage Body not long ago and the 8 inner gates formation middle dot 7th middle dot shocking gate was simultaneously opened. Even without the use of other noble phantasms, just relying on pure physical strength, Roy's punch is enough to sink an island. Block me, Binglan Admiral Army Bingshan. The beautiful face was distorted and deformed, and the demon god appeared in the ice. Tegu of the devil's essence grazily consumed the physical strength of Estes, the queen of ice. A large number of ice cavalry appeared, and then piled up together forming layers of iceberg shields to firmly protect us from behind. Click. There was a deafening loud and clear sound. The ice cavalry gathered like icebergs were like fragile paper. They couldn't hold on for even half a second before they were all smashed into pieces and turned into ice crystals flying all over the sky. Under the astonished gaze of Asts, Roy rushed out of the cold air like a god descending from heaven, and punched her in the abdomen mercilessly. Chapter 46 The Shinigami girl who beat Asts violently and was cut into two pieces, will die. Facing Roy so close and feeling the terrifying power in his fist, Asts felt that the flow of time had slowed down. She had never experienced death so closely. But this did not scare her, but made her more excited. Very good. That's it. This is a fight between strong men not just playing around with me and those revolutionary troops. The astonishing cold air erupted from her body again, almost freezing the void. The ice that was stronger than before turned into ice armor, covering Ast's arms and abdomen layer by layer. Then she crossed her arms to protect her abdomen, forming at least a dozen layers of ice shield. Boom! Roy's powerful punch hit Ast's arm hard. Crack! Under the heavy pressure, even though there were more than a dozen layers of ice shields, there was still a clear sound of bone breaking inside Ast's arm. 
Ah, gritting his teeth and enduring the severe pain of broken bones, Asts used his remaining strength to continue to condense solid ice, but to no avail. Click, click, layers of clear cracking sounds continued to sound, and in the blink of an eye, all the dozens of seemingly indestructible ice shields were broken. Boom. Without the protection of the ice shield at all, Roy's punch finally hit Asts in the abdomen. Wow. Blood spurted out from the ice queen's mouth like a fountain. Her ribs were all broken and some even punctured her internal organs and flesh and skin, which looked very terrifying. His widened eyes were bloodshot, almost falling out of their sockets because of the severe pain. The originally tall body turned into a crescent moon due to the heavy blow to the abdomen, curling up and shaking violently. Boom! Ace, who had completely lost her ability to fight, fell down, and Roy held her in his arms. This time he did not continue to beat Liu Hao violently like he did when he faced Liu Hao in the Hokage world. It's not because of sympathy. But because Ace Dez's physical strength is far from comparable to Liu Ha, the god killer, it only took one punch and it was so miserable. If Roy had hit her a few more times, the Ice Queen would have been beaten to death. Yes. Dot, 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 I lost. Lying in Roy's arms, the angry Ice Queen showed a gentle smile on her face. You can do whatever you want to me now. Are you crazy? Roy rolled his eyes at the woman in his arms. With your current injury, if I do something to you, you will probably die on the spot. Do you think I have an acrophilia? Who knows? Asts snorted softly and lay comfortably in Roy's arms as if he were coquettishly coquettish with his lover. You women are really weird. Looking at Asts, who was as well behaved as a pet cat, Roy couldn't think of him as the same person as the arrogant ice queen just now. Why do these women become closer to themselves after being beaten? Is it true that the saying hitting is affection, scolding is love is the truth in the world? If a man is not truthless, a woman will not love him. Too lazy to think about it, Roy took out the fairy bins that Jibril had given everyone before, lowered his head and fed them just mouth to mouth. Well, Ace's beautiful eyes widened, staring at Roy's face so close to him, but he didn't resist. Although Roy was almost completely inconsistent with her concept of mate selection, she surprisingly didn't hate this strong and violent man. The effects of fairy bins are terrifying. Within a few seconds of importing, Ast's ribs and arms that were broken by Roy returned to normal. But Ast didn't break free from Roy's arms. Instead, she hugged Roy tightly with her arms and bit back harder. For this ice queen, even the love between a man and a woman is no different from fighting. Damn, it's such a weird atmosphere. It was clear that just now we acted like enemies and acted mercilessly, but now we act like lovers again. Not far away, Yamamoto Jenry Uzai whispered to protect the trembling Nakiri Arena, and was speechless at Roy's attitude of chewing each other as if no one was around. Arena didn't say anything. She was almost stunned by the cold and now her mind was blank. Is this the strong man from Mother World? Grandpa, I want to go home. If you were with this kind of man, even normal couple behavior would be tortured to death. This is simply not something that an ordinary person can bear. Dot. You are Kai Hamuki. You 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 I have long known that such a day would come, but my queen sister has fallen like this. It's really abominable. I am so envious of his highness Roy. Tasakasura. Sora-chan is a little envious. Yamamoto Jenry Uzai whispered, Humphrey, no matter whether you are a man or a woman, they are all stumbling blocks on my way to becoming a strong person. Jibril, well, using ice to freeze time and space seems pretty powerful, but it's easy to deal with. Jibril, brother Roy, if you are only at this level, I will probably kill you instantly. Liu Oha, don't worry. He is not the only man of this level. It's just that Asts is too weak and there is no need for him to use other noble phantasms. Asts, it's true that I'm too weak. I still have a lot of ways to go. Jabril, oh, since you, the god killer, have said so, it's really exciting. Asts, by the way, I didn't fall. That was just part of the battle, nothing more. You are Kai Hamuki, is this so? Yes, the queen sister has not accepted his royal highness Roy. Yes, dot. The battle between Roy and Asts looks intense. In fact, he didn't show much talent. The increase in physical strength caused by the eight inner gates formation is indeed quite astonishing, but when you actually use it, you will find that it is just that. For example, if Roy just used the noble phantasm divine evasion, then he didn't even need to break through Ast's defense, he could directly injure her severely or even kill her on the spot. Therefore, in Roy's opinion, this amazingly powerful physical skill is just a pretty toy. Ten minutes later, looking at Roy and Ast's who were still biting and fighting each other, Yamamoto Genri Uzai whispered with a dark face. Did I say you two have eaten enough? It's not over, right? Are you jealous? A female Shinigami who has been single for hundreds of years. Asts finally took the initiative to let go of Roy, looked at Yamamoto Genri Uzai with a wicked smile and whispered, I am 18 years old this year. Yamamoto Genri Uzai spoke softly and looked at Asts with murderous eyes. Okay, okay, why are you two quarreling again? I remember you don't have any grudges either. Feeling baffled, Roy pushed Asts away, then turned to look at the black-haired Shinigami girl, and asked with a smile. Do you want to play a second game with me? Certainly. Slowly pulling out the Zanpei Kuto from his waist, Yamamoto Genryu's I whispered in a calm tone. 
the battle between the two of us will end in an instant. You don't have to worry about those subordinates frozen by asts who will freeze to death. Um dot 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 what does their life and death have to do with me? Not caring about the life and death of other people on the ship, a gorgeous golden sword slowly appeared in Roy's hand. But you are right about one thing, our battle will indeed end in an instant. Is it the noble phantasm of the sword obtained by killing pirate King Roger? I have seen its power more than once in the group live broadcast. Yamamoto Genryu's I whispered. His beautiful eyes narrowed slightly, and the majestic reactor in his body exploded like a tsunami. Bankai, the blade of the sky's final stream of light. Buzz, the holy light shines. The black-haired Shinigami girl's entire body turned into light and then she shot towards Roy like thousands of light blades. The speed of these lightsabers is the true speed of light. Such an appalling speed, combined with this terrifying attack range, plus the, direct death, ability that can cause death upon contact. I am perfectly hidden in the stream of light and cannot be captured. Shinigami Captain Yamamoto Genryu Zaishai Hkuni once commented that this is a killing blow that combines offense and defense with no flaws. However, Yamamoto Genryu Zai whispered that he was not sure of victory at all. No dot 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 not only was she sure of winning, she actually didn't think she would win at all. But when faced with mountains, only cowards would choose to escape rather than face them. Let me experience it for myself, that sword treasure that is comparable to the rules. In the stream of light, the black-haired Shinigami girl stared intently at Roy below. She saw Roy take action. God's avoidance. The golden sword light penetrated the heaven, earth and flowing light. This is a sword that ignores space, distance, time and defense. It is the ultimate blow that even gods cannot avoid. It is also the perfect fantasy form of the concept of cutting. It didn't even take a millisecond to accurately hit the whisper of Yamamoto Genryu's eye hidden in the light. Is this a sure hit sword that cannot be avoided, cannot be defended, and cannot be escaped? I can't understand. How can there be such unreasonable ability in the world? Is the gap between god and humans really so big? In midair, the black-haired Shinigami girl's eyes were dull. With a blessing of Hercules belt, Speed has no meaning, because no matter whether the enemy's speed is equal to the speed of light or exceeds the speed of light, Roy will only be faster than the opponent. God's avoidance ignores defense, space and distance, and is a sure hit attack that even gods cannot avoid. The combination of the two is an undoubted killer blow. Laugh. Blood rain fell from the sky, and Yamamoto Genryu's eyes broken body fell from the sky. Chapter 47 Okiji Rebelled World Live Broadcast begins. Available. Please order first. Customize. Boom. Yamamoto Genryu's eye whispered and his broken body fell into two parts on the deck, making a dull sound. Yuakai Hamuki, ah, uh, the violent Shinigami girl was killed. Tasuka Sura, quiet dot 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 quietly sister, asks, hey, hey, are you kidding? Shikasu Magoka, Mr. World Noble, Liu Oha, don't worry too much, this man is not an idiot, and it is impossible for him to do anything to destroy the city. Jabril, I said, have you forgotten that I gave everyone a fairy bean? Jabril, even if Roy's one is used by the ice girl. They still have three more. What are they afraid of, Jabril? But having said that, the intensity of the move just now was indeed a bit exaggerated. The lightsaber bombing with the, direct death, characteristic was okay. I could easily dodge it, Jabril. But that divine avoidance is too unreasonable, isn't it? How can there be such a move that ignores space, distance and time? Even Lord Artish, the god of war, can't do it. Seeing the miserable appearance of the Shinigami girl in the live broadcast, everyone was obviously shocked. But with Jabril's intervention, they remembered the existence of the fairy bins and couldn't help but heave a sigh of relief. They neither want to see group members die, nor do they want to see Roy leave the chat group. Jibril was even more shocked by the power of the noble phantasm displayed by Roy. But instead of feeling scared, she became more interested in Roy. A fluggle girl is not afraid of strong men and battles. Rather, the stronger the enemy, the more it arouses her desire to collect their heads. Even the god of war Artho who created her is like a parent. If Jibril had the ability to kill gods, she would never show mercy. And this is actually what the god of war Otto expects of her as an extra individual. Pirate world. Is this what it feels like to be cut off? You can definitely use it for next time. Looking at his severed lower body not far away, Yamamoto Genryu's eye whispered without any fear, but was still playing tricks. 17. You'd better eat a fairy bin quickly, otherwise you will become a cracked Poseidon like Ly Poseidon. 1. Roy rolled his eyes and kicked her lower body forward, joining it with her upper body. The black-haired Shinigami girl was silent for a moment, and then said, I at my fairy bins in Soul Society. Roy had a question mark on his face. Aren't you the eldest lady in Soul Society? Who dares to do something to you? Is it Azen? No, it's not. Yamamoto Genryu's eye whispered with a touch of embarrassment on his pretty face. It was me and my old man who were sparring. I used too much force and almost got roasted by him using Bankai. Dot. Yuakai Hamuki, Kasumagoka Shiu, TSK. Is this the Shinigami captain you mentioned? It seems to be quite powerful indeed. Roy felt a little headache. There is no way. We can't really let this woman die. So he could only look at Asts, who had been watching the battle. Mine has been used up a long time ago. Asts shook his head. After getting the fairy beans, 
In order to seek excitement, I rushed into the base camp of the Revolutionary Army alone and killed more than a dozen Tegu users, I almost died there. Dot. Roy, Liu Oha, Ha, same. After I got the fairy beans, I had a fight with my old enemy and killed him. Yuakai Hamuki, it is indeed the style of the Ice Queen and God Slayer, so handsome. Yuakai Hamuki, but the person killed by you, the leader's sister, shouldn't be the Marquis of Vauban, right? Liu Oha, exactly. Yuakai Hamuki. Awesome. I haven't liked that old man in the original work for a long time. He's ugly and loves to show off. He just begs to be beaten. Tasuka Sura, Sura, I think everyone should save Sister Kina first. I think she seems to be out of breath. Nakiri Arena, I'll do it. Pirate World. Arena, who was shivering from the cold, took out her fairy bins and walked to Yamamoto Genryuza and whispered to her to eat. The severed bodies were quickly put back together, and the Shinigami girl was resurrected with full blood. Hasendu is such a good baby. Opening his eyes and jumping up from the ground. Yamamoto Genryuzai raised his hand softly and patted Arena on the shoulder, and said carelessly, I owe you a life, I will protect you from now on. Okay dot 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 okay. Arena's teeth were trembling, so can you get rid of these ice cubes quickly? I'm about to freeze to death. Are this? Asts. Yamamoto Genryuzai whispered and looked at the originator of these ices. Asts nodded and released his Tegu ability. In an instant, everything melted away. The frozen sea returned to normal and the air temperature began to rise a little bit. The maids and crew members in the cabin finally returned to normal from the state of ice sculptures. One of the world government soldiers, who was not weak in strength, immediately took out a phone bug that had also just been thawed with a look of horror on his face. Hey, is this world government? The ship of the celestial dragon Roy Saint was attacked, and the attacker is probably Vice Admiral Okiji. Yes, that's right. It's definitely Logia Middle. Frozen Fruits ability. Yes, not Okiji. Asts, female, friend. Well. It could also be my future wife number three. Received a call from five elders asking if Okiji had really betrayed him. Although he didn't really like Okiji in his heart, Roy did not accuse him wrongly. Instead, he introduced the existence of Ests to several of them. Hang up the phone. The five elders looked at each other. If His Highness Roy did not lie, then the woman's strength potential is not weaker than Okiji. Admiral, it doesn't matter. Your Highness Roy is a celestial dragon after all. No matter how much you mess around, it will have no impact on the rule of the world government. Yes but the intelligence department needs to take a closer look. How can an admiral level strong men appear out of thin air? What a bunch of rubbish. HMPH, with such a strong man accompanying him, and his highness Roy's hidden power, that guy golden lion Shiki may be in trouble this time. Between the five old guys, in a few words, only the intelligence department was injured in the world. Dot. At the same time, after Roy and others ship left the sea area where they fought previously, that boy Okiji rebelled and attacked the celestial dragons. Is it Garp's order? That guy is helping Roger. The flash of fighting Okiji should be another logi of Ice Admiral Kizaru. TSK, it seems that there are also great differences in the order of the celestial dragons within Marine. What a great opportunity. Okiji and Kizaru will most likely both lose, and the difficulty of rescuing Lu will definitely be greatly reduced. Gee ha 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 ha, Roger. Lozi first rescued your wife, and then went to the underwater prison to rescue you. Will you still not obediently join Lozi's command? Two blonde men, one is swimming in the sea. The other is flying 10,000 meters above the sky. By accident, they saw the aftermath of the two battles from a distance. The familiar ice and flash made them both happy at the same time. In the blink of an eye, it is already the fourth day in the pirate world. I saw sea kings that were thousands of meters long, and I also experienced a storm that turned an island into rubble. Nakiri Arena feels that she has really grown a lot. Certainly, it would be better if those guys could stop making so much noise. Boom, with a loud noise. Asts was thrown hard to the deck by Roy, with blood spurting out of his mouth. But she wasn't annoyed, instead she got up even more excitedly. Opposite her is Roy who has opened the eight inner gates formation. The two are wrestling, which is a special way of intimacy. Thanks to the powerful physique and terrifying vitality brought by the sage body, Roy can even maintain the seventh gate for a long time without any consumption. This means that even if he doesn't use any noble phantasm and relies only on his physical strength, Roy is considered a rare strongman in the world of pirates. Asts is far inferior to him at this point. Without using the ice tegu, although she can't be said to be weak, she definitely can't be considered strong. This may be why Asts wants to wrestle with Roy, to exercise. Boom. Asts was hit to the ground so hard by Roy that his bones were almost broken. You two should take a rest first. Nakiri Arena, who looked unbearable, came up with juice and said to Roy, your subordinates just came to report that the destination is almost here. Okay, thanks. Taking the juice from Arena's hand, Roy showed a gentle smile on his face. My cute little cook. Wow. What a weird name this is. The innocent girl's defense was broken by a single blow. Her porcelain white face turned extremely red. She turned around and stumbled towards the cabin. TSK, you are really a simple young lady. Not far away, Yamamoto Genryuzai, who was sitting on a lounge chair and basking in the sun, 
whispered and shook his head. She felt that Nakiri Arena was not far away from falling, and there was only one opportunity left. But Astz didn't care at all. She is a supporter of the concept of Law of the Jungle. It seems normal to her that a powerful man or woman has a harem, and Nakiri Arena is a weakling without any strength. Even if she really becomes Roy's woman, she won't be any threat in Astz's eyes. South Blue Kofranan. The island has a small population, only more than 10,000 people, so it is considered an ordinary town. But not long ago, a group of marines broke the peace here. The leader is Vice Admiral Ghost Spider, a staunch supporter of Ake Ainu. He is also one of the five vice admirals for this South Blue operation. At this time, the warships under his command were aiming their artillery at the island's port, and no one was allowed to leave. On the bow of the warship, a masked man who looked like a reporter was holding a phone and preparing to take pictures. It was said that he had received orders from the Celestial Dragons. I don't know what the Tanlong people are going to do. Is it such a big scene to capture the Pirate King's widow? The ghost spider whispered, but a world government ship suddenly appeared in his eyes. Finally come. His face instantly became extremely serious and dignified. Grabbing the panicked reporter, ghost spider used moonwalk to jump into the air, and soon landed on Roy's boat. Roy Saint. Ghost spider saluted respectfully, I am the Vice Admiral Ghost Spider of the headquarters, at your service. Well, I know you, say Keizuki's right hand man are pretty good. A casual remark. The compliment made Ghost Spider happy. Roy looked sideways at the reporter. Is Morgan's ready? Roy Saint, please put it down. As long as there is a big screen, you can definitely watch the live broadcast. The reporter knelt down on his knees in an extremely respectful manner. Then let's get started. Roy ordered. Yes. The reporter immediately turned on the live broadcast function of the phone bug. The next second, Roy has appeared on big screens around the world. Huh? Who is this? Roy Saint, the celestial dragon was very popular in the newspapers a few days ago. He is a romantic celestial dragon who sings every night. What is he doing live streaming? The devil knows. Damn it. I'm so envious. Why was I not born into the 713 Tanlong clan, but into a poor family? So handsome. Son, when he passes through our country, you must ask your father to invite the Saint Roy over. This dot 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 is, Queen Mother. Damn Tanlong people, sooner or later Lozi will kill all these scum. Around the world, seeing Roy, the Draco, appear on the live broadcast screen, People reacted in different ways. Some people were envious, some were jealous, and naturally some wanted to tear him into pieces. Of course Roy doesn't care what these weaklings think. Standing in front of the live broadcast camera, Roy had a gentle smile on his face. Everyone from all over the world, I am Saint Nirona Roy, a celestial dragon. Today's live broadcast has only one purpose dash. Capture the wife of Pirate King Roger, Potkas de Rouge. As soon as the words fell, the world was shaken. Capture the wife of Pirate King Roger? Aren't these celestial dragons afraid of Roger's revenge? Idiot. Didn't you read the news a few days ago? Marine has been searching South Blue for many days, and Roger has long been secretly captured by Marine. Wah dot 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 what? The Pirate King actually lost to Marine? HMPH. It's best if all the trash pirates are dead. Arsehole. Damn Draco. New World. Whitebeard punched the void angrily and the explosive shockwave set off a tsunami of staggering scale in the sea. Wanokini, Kaido of the Beasts brought his daughter Yamato and laughed loudly. This is the fate of the weak. Not only was he caught by Marine, but he couldn't even protect his wife. Roger, that guy Kangren can also. Defeating Captain Rocks. I think he's a complete loser. Is Roy the Celestial Dragon Saint? Yamato sat on Kaido's shoulder and watched the live broadcast with a confused expression. She couldn't understand how happy she was. But that didn't stop her from recognizing Roy. It's the bad guy in the underwater prison. Pointing at Roy Yamato in the live broadcast, he shouted, I will definitely give him a stick in the future. Snapped. Kaido slapped Yamato on the little head and cursed angrily, Idiot daughter, that is your goal Lozi, not yours. Naval headquarters. All the doves, Marine, sighed, feeling that Marine was helping others. Buddha Sengoku, Vice Admiral Jirazu is secretly worried about Garp's fate. They all know that Garp has secretly traveled to South Blue. South Blue. Garp. Golden Lion and Rayleigh, who were in three places, watched the live broadcast, and Fang's face was so gloomy that he could shed tears. Their relationship with Roger is either close friends or enemies, but this does not prevent them from admiring Roger as a person. Chapter 48 If you don't surrender, I will destroy an island. Lozi hasn't killed a celestial dragon yet, this time he just had the fun of it. I think Roger will also have to thank Lozi for saving his wife's life. The Golden Lion flew into the sky with a ferocious expression, returned to his main ship and flew at high speed in the direction of Roy. Rayleigh and Garp are also preparing to leave. At this time, Roy spoke again during the live broadcast. She is the only one I want to capture, but because of Bortka's de Rouge's lack of cooperation, Marine has wasted a lot of manpower and material resources in South Blue, so I am very unhappy. Under the incomprehensible gaze of people all over the world, Roy started the live broadcast of the chat group, and then uttered a mysterious spirit in his mouth. Sky, tear it apart. Stars, smash them to pieces. Everything in the sky is mine. 
and everything that rules the stars is mine. Violent divine power emerged from Roy's body. Even though they were thousands of miles away from the live broadcast screen, Whitebeard and other strong men from all over the world still couldn't help but widen their eyes. Crackling, the black thunder was like a dragon and snake, wrapping around Roy. That is a divine thunder that is as hot as the flames of the sun, enough to destroy everything in the world. Condensing the divine thunder filled with destructive aura into a thunder gun. Roy held a satisfied smile on his face. The essence of this divine thunder is a noble phantasm that can destroy planets and destroy the world. Now the level of the noble phantasm is not high enough, so it can only destroy the country. But after reciting all the words, the power of this noble phantom has increased several times. It is overkill to deal with a mere island. Go for it. His muscles bulged high, and he threw the thunder spear in his hand towards Pan An Island in front of him. Roy read out the true name of the noble phantom loudly. I am the thunder that tears apart the stars. Boom. The deafening thunder irritated the eardrums of people all over the world, and the live broadcast screen was completely covered by black lightning. Islands around the world seem to be shaken violently. What happened? At this moment, the same question appears in the minds of people all over the world. South Blue. Under the horrified gaze of the ghost spider, the sky cracked. The thunder spear turned into black thunder and fell from the sky, completely covering Panin Island and its surrounding waters like a downpour, making it airtight. From a human's tiny perspective, it seems as if the entire world has turned into a sea of thunder and lightning. The world is roaring and the sea is trembling. It was as if there was a huge giant of unimaginable size, shaking and playing with the planet they were on. Sensing the terrifying energy that he had never seen in his life, Ghost Spider, who was knocked to the ground, finally understood what kind of terrifying thing Roy, a celestial dragon, was doing. Even though he was a hawkish marine general, he was also frightened by Roy's madness. That is an island with tens of thousands of people living there. How could those people survive such a horrific attack? A long time, the turbulence of the sea gradually subsided, the black thunder in the sky finally dispersed, and the live broadcast screen returned to normal. The whole world fell silent. The island of Frenan disappeared. Even the sea in the nearby sea area was completely evaporated by the high temperature divine thunder. As a result, a deep crater was formed in the sea that was more than ten times larger than the previous island and a large amount of seawater was pouring in from the surrounding area. Seeing this scene, anyone with a brain can realize what happened. Frenan Island was completely destroyed by that weird black thunder. The earthquake-like shock they just felt was the aftermath of the destruction of the island. What a joke. Is that the legendary ancient weapon? Thunder fruit? No dot 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 even that guy Whitebeard can't wipe out an island with one blow. This celestial dragon deserves to die. Is this the real reason why the celestial dragons have been able to rule the world for 800 years? The civilians didn't know that much, they only knew that the Tan Long people used a powerful and strange method to destroy an island, and even caused a worldwide poisonous chaos. But Whitebeard, Golden Lion, Rayleigh and other top warriors on the sea all understand how terrifying the Black Thunder is. Whitebeard even had a rare and strong sense of crisis, because even he didn't dare to say that he could be intact under that terrifying Black Thunder. 23. Marco, the captain of the first team, looked at Whitebeard with a worried look. Cool la la I'm just stunned. Never showing any weakness in front of his sons, Whitebeard clenched his nage nata and laughed to the sky. After Roger died, Losey was the strongest man in the world. Whitebeard, how could he be scared by a mere celestial dragon brat? Dad is right. That's right. It's just a celestial dragon. Even if it is really the legendary ancient weapon, Dad's shock fruit is not something to be trifled with. Seemingly inspired by Whitebeard's words, the captains of the Whitebeard Pirates immediately erased the shadows in their hearts. As long as Dad is here, the Whitebeard Pirates are invincible. This is the Celestial Dragon. In the Naval Headquarters Conference Room, Marshal Kong let out a long sigh. Next to them, Buddha Sengoku, Vice Admiral Crane and all the Marine Generals fell silent. They wanted to loudly accuse Roy of being cruel, but that made no sense. They don't dare to resist the Draco and World Government. Is this the real reason why the Dan Long people can stand at the top of the world? Former Admiral Zephyr said to himself in a hoarse voice. It's really a power that makes people feel desperate. Dot. In the chat group, compared with the depressed mood of the powerful people in the pirate world, the atmosphere here is much better. Yuakaiva Mickey Colon. Dot, dot, dot. It seems that I want to thank His Highness Roy for not killing me. Liu Oh how? It is truly a star facing noble phantasm. Even if it is at a low level, you can still glean its astonishing power from it. Jabril, very good. You are now the second most prized prey in my heart, second only to Lord Artish, the god of war. That's great. Nakiri Arena. So cruel. Kasuma Gokushu, you are right, but this is Tan Long. You can just understand him as a debauched and extremely cruel tyrant. Asts, it's so boring to stay in the cabin. The so called Golden Lion and Pluton haven't come yet? Yamamoto Genri Yuzai whispered, wait a moment, Rouge hasn't shown up yet, they will definitely not come. Dot. Not paying attention to the comments about him in the chat group, Roy felt the loss of his physical strength. Should I say it is truly an enhanced version of Sage Body? After liberating the anti national noble phantasm with all his strength, 
He actually felt that his physical strength had not been consumed much, and he was not even a little bit stronger than before. Roy saying dot 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 the live broadcast screen has been restored. Ghost Spider looked at Roy cautiously. The Marine Vice Admiral subconsciously knelt on one knee in front of Roy at some point, for fear of offending the monster in front of him because of his disrespect. Um, Roy nodded and looked at the live broadcast camera. His tone was as gentle as before, you must have seen that this is the beginning of the punishment. From now on, every half hour, if Portka's de Rouge does not surrender to the Marine near her, I will destroy an island. Under the horrified and angry gaze of people around the world, the smile on Roy's face became gentler, but the words he spoke were bitingly cold, Portka's de Rouge, I want to give you a piece of advice. Your choice affects the lives of millions of people. Please be cautious. Make a decision. I dot 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 did I hear it correctly? Damn it. Is this Tan Long man crazy? He wants to destroy an island and kill so many innocent people just for a mere woman. This is the Tan Long people. Scary, cruel, unreasonable and they don't treat other people as human beings at all. Arsol, isn't Marine just? Why don't you stop him? Stop it, those Marines are simply dogs of the world government. Isn't it funny if you let the dogs bite their owners? Roy's horrifying announcement sent the entire world into an uproar. This method of harming innocent people to force the target is actually the norm in the pirate world. But there are definitely not many people like Roy who use the lives of an island or a country as a bargaining chip. People were angry, scared, and roaring wantonly. But there was nothing they could do. Whitebeard, Garp. Rayleigh and others were staring at the live broadcast, wanting to see if Roy would really do something so crazy. South Blue's Petelia Island huddled in a cheap house, the pregnant woman's body trembled slightly and tears streamed down her face. She felt that she had killed innocent people on Frenan Island. But what is she going to do? Do you really want to surrender to that celestial dragon? It doesn't matter if she dies, but what about the child in her belly? Soon, half an hour passed. Sorry, Miss Rouge, it seems you made the wrong decision. Shaking his head at the live broadcast. Roy ordered Ghost Spider to sail the boat. Where to go? Ghost Spider asked subconsciously. The Kingdom of Roses. 11. The name of a kingdom came out of Roy's mouth. Ghost Spider recalled it and remembered that this was a small country in South Blue that was not a member of the world government and was famous for its tourism industry. Of course, even a small country has a population of more than 100,000. Far beyond the Panan Island that was destroyed by Roy just now. Is Saint Roy planning to? With a shiver in his heart. Ghost Spider didn't dare to ask any more questions, let alone disobey Roy's order. Soon, the ship came to the waters of an island country. This is the Rose Kingdom, as beautiful as the rumors say. Looking at the bright roses that bloomed all over the island, Roy sighed softly. Unfortunately, those who are unwilling to join the world government and contribute heavenly gold to us and other celestial dragons do not have human rights. The words fell. The star-destroying divine thunder whose prototype comes from God Deer's use once again appears in the eyes of the world. People from all over the world were fortunate enough to see the terrifying world of thunder again, and they were sure that the shock they felt before was by no means an illusion. Boom. With earth-shaking roars and shocks that affected the entire world, this tourist kingdom that was quite famous in South Blue was turned into ashes in the sky full of divine thunder with no residue left. Dot this, is the second one. Roy smiled softly at the live broadcast camera, Miss Rouge, you don't want a third country to suffer such a disaster, right? At this moment, the whole world fell into silence again. Even the cruel pirates who had massacred many villages and towns were so scared by Roy that they dared not speak out. Many civilians are even more. I cried on the spot. Many people also began to curse loudly. But it wasn't Roy they were scolding. But Roy's target, Rouge. Damn it. Is that woman named Rouge planning to kill everyone? Get out of here. That's the wife of the Pirate King. She won't live like a commoner. Damn it. You're a piece of trash Pirate King. Marine should have killed that bastard with a thousand cuts. That's right. If the couple hadn't angered the Celestial Dragons, how could South Blue have suffered such a disaster? Voices like this are growing louder around the world. It is obvious that Roy is the one who is destroying the country, but it seems that everyone is starting to blame Rouge. If you had come forward earlier. Wouldn't those innocent people have died? This is what people really think. New World, Whitebeard Pirates. Marco clenched his fists, his eyes full of horror. Are you kidding? How can attacks of this scale be unleashed continuously? Looking at his relaxed appearance, it seems as if he has not exhausted any energy at all. Of Whitebeard said nothing, but his expression became much more solemn. Golden Lion, Rayleigh and Garp in South Blue also had similar thoughts. They are still not sure whether Roy's devil fruit ability is or he really has mastered the legendary ancient weapon but there is no doubt that Roy is extremely dangerous. Rouge. Garp was very confused at this time. As a righteous Marine Vice Admiral, he should hope that Rouge surrenders as soon as possible to save the innocent people who are about to die tragically at Roy's hands. But because of Roger's entrustment, he didn't want Rouge to surrender. After all, if it falls into the hands of Roy, a cruel celestial dragon, everyone knows what terrible things will happen. Rayleigh and Golden Lion don't have as many worries as Garp. No matter how many civilians die, they don't care. It's best if they don't show it. 
the money is good. But if Wu really surrenders, they will take action without hesitation. Just a pampered celestial dragon who can't walk when he sees a beautiful woman. Even if he has mastered extremely destructive abilities, his combat experience cannot be compared to that of battle-hardened pirates like them. In the chat group, Yuakai Hamuki, do you think Rouge will come out and surrender? Tasukasura? Probably not, after all, she is pregnant. Liu Oha, it doesn't matter, you time travelers have already known her hiding place. It doesn't make any difference whether she surrenders or not. Her fate is already determined. Nakiri Arena, what will Mr. Oi do with that Rouge? Kill her and the child in her belly? Kasuma Gokushu, no. Kasuma Gokushiha, although Mr. World Nobleman is a scumbag, he still cares about beauty. Most beauties will receive preferential treatment. Asts, it's so annoying. Why doesn't that woman come out? If she doesn't come out, the pirates won't come out either. At Yamamoto Genri Asai whispers, I'm going to fight that Pluton really later. Yamamoto Genri Uzai whispered, okay, then I will fight Golden Lion and leave Garp to Ake Aina who is coming over. This marine hero dares to interfere with Roy's matter. He probably won't survive this time. I have reached the age where the original novel has a grandson. Yamamoto Genri Uzai whispered, by the way, I think Rouge will surrender soon. From the original work, it can be seen that she is a quite gentle woman. Poru Poru. As soon as Yamamoto Genri Uzai finished speaking softly, the phone on Roy's ship rang. Roy Saint, a maid respectfully brought the phone bug up to pick it up. Well, go down. Taking the phone, Roy answered the call. Hello, it's me, Roy Saint. The phone bug simulated Stussy's appearance, and a charming voice sounded in his ears. Podkas de Rouge, surrendered. Chapter 49 You don't want your children to become slaves, right? As Yamamoto Genri Uzai whispered, Rouge is a gentlewoman after all. For Roger, she could go against the natural laws of human pregnancy and childbirth. Let the child stay in your body for a full 20 months, and finally die of exhaustion. Naturally, she could choose to sacrifice herself and her children in order to prevent more innocent people from being sacrificed. I thought you would come out earlier. Knowing that Rouge was beside Stussy, Roy smiled playfully. If you had come out earlier, the Rose Kingdom probably wouldn't have been destroyed, right? This is indeed my fault. Although I cannot undo the tragedy. I can only stand up and die. I think Roger will agree with my choice. A cold yet gentle voice of a strange young woman sounded from the other side of the phone. Stussy and Marine Vice Admiral were surrounded by fire. And there were still wet tears on Rouge's face. The originally clear, sunny, and cheerful eyes now became grey and lost their luster. She actually doesn't care too much about her own life and death. But the unborn child in her belly and the tens of thousands of innocent people brutally murdered by Roy almost crushed her spirit. If she hadn't witnessed those tragedies, she could have deceived herself that Marine would not harm other pregnant women in South Blue. But after seeing the black thunder that tore apart the sky and sea and destroyed it, Rouge understood. If she doesn't stand up, this celestial dragon named Roy will probably slaughter the entire South Blue to pieces. Scum, butcher, no words, no matter how horrific, are enough to describe Roy's inhumane cruelty. So it was just to death. She stood up. Anyway, by then, their family can be reunited, wouldn't it be nice? Bring her over here, Stussy. Seeing that Rouge stopped talking, Roy gave instructions casually. Yes, Roy Saint. Stussy hung up the phone respectfully. Then he turned his head and looked at this charming beauty playfully. She has long golden pink hair, a well-proportioned figure and exquisite facial features. The little tits on Madara's face did not damage her beauty at all, but made her more playful. Regardless of her appearance, personality, or how she dresses, it can be seen that this is an extremely pure girl. It's a pity that when you meet 017 people, you are not a kind person. First, he met Roger, the pirate king who died young. And because Roger was targeted by the celestial dragon Roy, Stussy can already imagine what kind of tragic life this rouge will have in the future. What's wrong? Why are you looking at me like this? Feeling very uncomfortable when Stussy looked at her goods, Rouge frowned. Shouldn't you take me there quickly and conduct a worldwide public execution so that people can see the tragic end of the Pirate King's wife? Public execution. Stussy was stunned for a moment, and then laughed with a poof sound. Ha ha ha. Interesting. You are such an interesting woman. Unexpectedly, Rouge, a simple woman, would actually think that Roy would go to such great lengths to publicly execute her. Stussy couldn't help laughing. Rouge had a puzzled look on his face, but he felt a little more relaxed inside when he was originally nervous. Could it be that? What awaited her was not actually a public execution. D. Vice Admiral Huo Shashan sighed on the side. He had seen the absurdity of Roy, a celestial dragon, in the newspaper, and he was already aware of what would happen next. Rouge's surrender made most people watching the live broadcast in the pirate world breathe a sigh of relief. Finally, we don't have to see Roy's cruel act of destroying the country. At the same time, more people became curious. What will the pirate king's wife look like? An ugly girl? Still a beauty? No matter who she is. She must die. That's right. One Piece's family should not live in this world. Yes, this is revenge on Roger and retribution for killing so many innocent people. Similar remarks are heard all over the world. Especially the local people in South Blue are extremely dissatisfied and resentful towards Rouge. If you don't go to so many places in New World, 
Grand Line and the other three sea areas. Why would you hide in our South Blue? Damn it. Batila Island is not very far from the waters where the Rose Kingdom is located. Coupled with the extremely fast speed of the Marine warship, it didn't take long for Roy to meet the widow of the Pirate King. Is this the wife of the Pirate King? It's pretty, but dot 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 is it too ordinary? Seeing the pregnant girl who was escorted by Stussy and Vice Admiral to Roy, everyone in the Pirate world was stunned. The image of the Pirate King's wife was completely different from what they had imagined before. Besides being really pretty, she is just like a perfect girl next door. At the same time, in the chat group, Yuakai Hamuki started going crazy again. Yuakai Hamuki, ah, enemy wife plus teenage pregnant woman, it perfectly matches my XP system. Yuakai Hamuki, damn it, I really envy his highness Roy. Tatakasura, Muki ne, a good wife, is always so scary. Nekiri Arena, is this the wife of the most vicious man in the world? She looks so pitiful. Kasuma Gokushu, ah, this look that makes me feel pity for you can easily arouse men's desire for protection. Liu Oha, you can get ready. The appearance of this woman means that the real battle is coming. Yamamoto Genri Uzai whispered, Well, just like what was assigned before, I am against the Golden Lion. Asts, me to Pluton Rayleigh. Jabril, it seems that Roy is very similar to me. I kill powerful races and collect their heads as trophies. But Roy, you kill powerful people and collect their wives as trophies. Trophies? Nakiri Arena, BFFT. What an astonishing statement. Kasuma Goku Shiha colon dot 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 but it seems to be just right. It would be better to say that this is the perfect embodiment of the scumbag that Mr. World Nobleman is. This woman, seeing what Kasuma Goku she called him, Roy couldn't help but shook his head. He was quite tolerant of this heisy girl's habit of giving herself random nicknames. Thinking of the girl's gentle kiss in the world where time stopped. He thought that he should find an opportunity to give her the devil fruit. Otherwise, even if Kasuma Goku Shiha had drawn a treasure like Eternal Mange Kyo Sharingan before, it would be difficult for her to use it normally with her physical strength. Of course, this is all for later. He has more important things at the moment. Looking down at the pregnant girl walking towards him, Roy's voice was extremely cold. Podkas de Rouge, kneel down. Does he want to kneel down on his own? After hearing Roy's order, Rouge, who was walking towards him, paused. The look of humiliation on his face flashed away. But she was mentally prepared and did not refuse. She knelt down to Roy honestly. Good. Roy showed a satisfied smile on his face and continued to order, climb over here. Rouge trembled but said nothing. But she still did as she was told, trying her best to protect her belly, and crawled toward Roy on her hands and knees like a pet dog. She was even prepared to die before, so naturally she wouldn't care about these so-called humiliations. You bastard. You insulted Roger's wife like this. New World, Whitebeard, who was watching the live broadcast, turned red with anger and punched the sea with another punch packed with concussive power, BHBC. Marco, Josie and other captains were also indignant, scolding Roy for not being a good man, for a man who actually bullied a pregnant woman. But they didn't notice it, in the corner where no one cared. Blackbeard Teach looked at Roy's figure in the live broadcast, his eyes full of envy and yearning. Is this the celestial dragon, the god and noble of this world? Seeing the humble posture of the black thief king's wife kneeling in front of Roy like a slave, Blackbeard couldn't help but feel his blood rising. As long as I get the power of dark fruit, I can also have this kind of power. At the same time, South Blue, Rayleigh, who was diving under the seabed below the warship where Roy and others were, waiting for the opportunity to take action, was so angry that he almost choked. This bastard actually dares to humiliate Roger's wife like this. I must make him pay a heavy price. We also want Marine and World Government, as well as people around the world who are watching the live broadcast to realize that anyone who dares to attack Roger's family will surely suffer horrific and reckless revenge from the Roger pirates. However, Directly above Roy and others, at an altitude of 10,000 meters, the golden lion Shiki who was originally eager to try was in no hurry to move. This celestial dragon brat doesn't seem to want to kill Roger's wife directly, but to humiliate her. Keenly aware of Roy's thoughts, the golden lion grinned with a ferocious smile, gee ha ha ha, this is good, let Roger see his wife being severely insulted by the Tanlong people, and he will probably understand the importance of allies. If you have sex, you won't refuse Lozi's invitation anymore, right? Unfortunately. The flying pirate Golden Lion didn't know that Roger, whom he had longed for, had died tragically in the hands of Roy in the undersea prison. Even Roger, the legendary pirate king, was taken away by Roy who killed him and turned into the precious phantom god's avoidance, which became his trophy. At this time, Potkas de Rouge had already crawled in front of Roy. Due to his poor physical strength due to his pregnancy, a thin layer of sweat appeared on his porcelain white forehead. What? Isn't this very obedient? It's completely different from before he surrendered. Looking at Rouge lying at his feet like a pet dog. Roy's originally cold voice became much gentler, get up, dot. Rouge stood up with a dull expression. T.S.K., who are you showing this dead face to? Roy frowned, very dissatisfied with the dull expression of the woman in front of him. He is not one of those idiots. If things like slaves and women have no emotions, what is the difference between them and artificial dolls? So, 
Under Rouge's horrified gaze, Roy's eyes suddenly shifted to her belly. Is this your beloved child? Roy leaned close to Rouge and said softly, Miss Rouge, you don't want your child to become a slave of the celestial dragons and live a sad, miserable and dark life, right? Dot. Rouge's beautiful eyes shrank, and Rouge's originally stiff and dull face instantly turned red, and her eyes looking at Roy were filled with hatred. The child is the reverse scale of the mother. Roy's words are soft and gentle. It was easy to anger Rouge and successfully gain the hostility of this kind woman. But Roy likes it very much. This bulging and cute look is not a little bit more agile than before. This is a living person, not a machine or a rag doll. Very good, this look is very good. I like it very much. Roy smiled wantonly and raised his palm to grab Rouge's chin. Then he bowed his head and showed no mercy. Rouge's wide eyes were full of confusion and humiliation. Before coming here, she thought she would be publicly executed, and she also thought she would be brutally tortured to extract a confession. But I never thought that I would be so humiliated by Roy, a celestial dragon, in front of people all over the world. Sorry dot 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 Roger. He wanted to push Roy away but couldn't, and he didn't dare to use too much force to hurt the child in his belly. Rouge had only accept his fate calmly. What's happening here? People around the world watching the live broadcast were stunned. What are the celestial dragons doing to the pirate king's pregnant wife? Although I have long seen Roy's messy deeds with the princesses and queens of various kingdoms from newspapers, this is too dot 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 exciting. Okay, kiss me well, little celestial dragon. 10,000 meters above the ground, Golden Lion was so excited that he clapped his hands when he saw Roger's pregnant wife being bullied by Roy. Thinking of Roger's merciless rejection of him before, and then seeing Roger's wife's humiliating look, he felt extremely happy. Didn't you reject Losey? If you had agreed to Losey's alliance, how could you have been caught by Marine, and how could your wife have been bullied by the Celestial Dragons? However, the extremely excited Golden Lion did not forget the true purpose of his trip. He wants to use Roger's wife to win over Roger. Therefore, while being excited, Golden Lion has been using Observation Haki to keep a close eye on Roy's movements. As long as Roy has the slightest intention to kill someone, he will directly save them. But unlike Golden Lion, someone couldn't help it anymore. Arsal. Under the sea, Rayleigh, who had been waiting for an opportunity, rushed out of the sea angrily. The right arm of the Pirate King has a close relationship with Roger. Even brothers are not as strong as their friendship. Seeing his friend's pregnant wife being so insulted, if he could continue to endure it, he would not be the legendary Pirate Pluton who shocked the sea. Dragon brat, you deserve to die. Seeing Rouge's horrified expression, Rayleigh growled, pulled out the sword from his waist, and slashed at Roy from afar. God avoids. Chapter 50 Sword vs Ice. I like my daughter. Boom. Conqueror's Haki's volley slashed towards Roy at high speed. This is a sword skill derived from Roger the Pirate King, and it is also Rayleigh's most lethal move. Rayleigh is confident enough that he can cut Roy in half before he can use the terrifying Black Thunder. What? Enemy attack. Protect Liu Yixing. Unexpectedly? The vice captain of One Piece would be hiding under the sea, and the two vice admiral, Qo Shashan and Ghost Spider, were caught off guard and were shocked. But at this time he wanted to make a remedy but it was too late. Rayleigh's sword was too sudden and too fast. But just when this slash that no god could avoid was about to hit Roy, a biting cold air emerged out of thin air, and even the water vapor in the void was frozen. Bingland Admiral Army, the woman's voice, which was as cold as the cold air, echoed in everyone's ears. Kaka Kaka. The turbulent sea turned into an endless ice field in an instant, and the overwhelming ice cavalry galloped and roared, colliding with Rayleigh's slash. Boom. The deafening explosion irritated the eardrums of everyone present. Thousands of ice cavalry were torn apart by the terrifying sword energy and turned into ice crystals flying in the sky, almost making everyone present shiver. The sword energy that Rayleigh slashed was also scattered in all directions, leaving dense and terrifying cracks on the frozen sea for several kilometers. Aokiji, looking at the biting frost in the sky. Rayleigh instantly thought of the young man named Okiji in Marine. Wasn't he and Kizaru both injured? He actually still had the strength to block his own slashing attack, but when he looked up, he was stunned. What appeared in front of him was not the Marine Vice Admiral of Logia Frozen Fruit, but a very strange blue-haired woman. The one who blocked Rayleigh was in Logia's Marine Vice Admiral Okiji. This woman is so beautiful, so strong. Is she Marine's secret weapon? Idiot. This woman is obviously a subordinate of the Danlong people. She must be a slave or bodyguard. This woman should be Logia Middle. Frozen Fruit's lower level substitute ability. Just like Lava Lava Fruit and Mera Mera Fruit. No. Frozen Fruit's low level substitution ability cannot freeze the sea so easily let alone block Pluton Rayleigh's killing blow. I think she should have a freezing-type fantasy beast ability. The appearance of Asts immediately aroused the interest of live broadcast experts from all over the world. At the same time, they were also secretly frightened. A beautiful woman who most likely has the potential to be the top powerhouse in the sea also has this extremely conspicuous freezing ability, but they have never heard of each other. 
How many terrifying forces are hidden within the world government? Are you Pluton really, standing on the frozen sea covered with sword marks? Ast's delicate face was full of fanatical fighting spirit. Let me, Astes, see your power. Your name is Ast's. With such strength and courage, why do you want to degenerate and become a lackey of the celestial dragons? Looking at the powerful and beautiful girl in front of him, Lee felt extremely pity. In his opinion, if the Ast's in front of him was a pirate, she could at least become a legend at the level of a party's overlord. Instead of becoming the lackeys, bodyguards or even slaves of the celestial dragons like now, losing their dignity and freedom. Boring to so discord. A stay's eyes were full of contempt. Just trash pirates are just frogs trapped in the well inside the world. How can we understand how grand the goals of us people are? I don't know what to say. You are so stubborn. Get out of my way. Glancing at his friend's wife who was still being humiliated in Roy's arms on the deck, Rayleigh, who was extremely anxious, waved the sword in his hand again and made a terrifying slash that could cut through the sea. Sword energy? A boring attack. It might have been difficult for me to deal with it in the past, but now, under the continuous transformation of the power of the God of War, Asts seems to be really transforming into the direction of the Valkyrie. She took one step forward, and her white high-heeled military boots shattered the ice. The terrifying cold air around her body spewed out crazily, pressing towards Rayleigh like a mountain roaring and a tsunami. The demon god appears middle dot the demon's essence middle dot dehansion. Click, click, click. Wherever the cold air that almost turned into substance passed through, the air and the invisible storm were frozen. Even the sword energy that Rayleigh slashed out was enough to cut through mountains and seas, but it was easily frozen in the void, unable to move forward. What? Rayleigh was shocked. He couldn't understand why his invincible sharp slash not only failed to cut through Ast's cold air, but was actually frozen. This is something that not even Okiji, who is a user of freezing abilities, can do. Yuakai Hamuki, of course. In the chat group, Yuakai Hamuki, who had been following the live broadcast, immediately boasted. Sister Queen is the Ice Queen who can freeze time and space. Such a thing as sword energy is just like water. Yamamoto Genri Yuzi I whispered, no, it's Ace who has become stronger again. Yuakai Hamuki, eh? Is that so? Liu Oh how? Yes, don't forget that a few days ago Roy defeated Ast's Ice Tegu with brute force. Now she has obviously taken a step further. Yamamoto Genri Yuzi I whispered, should I say that she really deserves to be a woman who has obtained the power of the God of War? The battle with Roy obviously failed, and she did not play a role but she still relied on her own power to complete the breakthrough. It is simply Ice Valkyrie. Everyone in the chat group is very envious of Ast's progress, but they are not jealous. After all, they all saw Ast's efforts. In his own world, he would fight with strong men every now and then. After getting the fairy beans, he would attack the enemy's base camp alone. Even in the past few days when she came to the pirate world for missions, she spent a lot of time fighting Roy, during which she was beaten and vomited blood countless times. For such a hard-working, talented, and powerful cheating woman, Success is inevitable. It would be a strange thing if she couldn't become a strong person. Rayleigh couldn't see the impact of the world live broadcast, and Asts have no time to care about the comments in the chat group. The two men have now passed the testing stage and are fighting against each other with all their strength. Sword vs Ice. Ultimate's sharpness vs Ultimate's freezing. The terrifying sword energy and cold energy centered on the two of them and spread in all directions. Even the clouds 10,000 meters high in the sky were frozen into ice cubes and then work out into pieces. Are these two monsters? Unable to get close to the center of the battlefield, the two vice admirals, Ghost Spider and Huo Shashan, stared at the exaggerated battle scene with their mouths agape, even forgetting to protect Roy, the celestial dragon. Of course, Roy, who is now physically stronger than everyone present, does not need protection at all. There are others who need protection. He sits so cold. In an environment where the temperature continued to drop, Rue shouldn't help but shudder, and his body began to tremble slightly. She is just an ordinary person, so naturally she cannot bear this world of ice and snow, which is like a natural disaster. If you continue to stay, I'm afraid you will freeze to death in a short time. Child, squeezing out two words through his teeth, Rouge looked at Roy with pleading eyes. Podcast de Rouge is probably the best mother in the One Piece world. During the natural disaster-like battle between Asts and Rayleigh, everyone else was thinking about how to save their own lives, but she was the only one thinking about her child. As a mother's instinct, she realized that if she didn't leave here quickly and go to a warm and comfortable place, her child would definitely not be safe. Either she was frozen and miscarried, or she was shocked to the point of miscarriage by the aftermath of the battle between these two strong men, Rayleigh and Asts. The most important is, she felt that the celestial dragon in front of her who was frivolous to her didn't seem to want to kill her. This gave Rouge a slight desire to survive. She and the child might have a chance to survive. As for the humiliation she suffered, it was not worth mentioning at all in the face of the child's safety. You want to protect your child? Roy lowered his head and looked down at the woman in his arms. The pale Rouge nodded with all his strength. Whatever it takes. Roy had an evil smile on his face. Dot 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 that's right. This time Rouge hesitated for a second, and then his eyes became extremely firm. Okay. 
I see. Roy was satisfied with the recognition of the woman in his arms. Just as Kasuma Gokushu said in the chat group, Roy is a compassionate person. Since Rouge himself has compromised, he will naturally not do anything cruel to him. Of course, that doesn't mean Roy won't do something to her. Even for Rouge, an expectant mother, what Roy will do next will be even more exciting. Under the question marks that filled the chat group chat room, Roy closed the group live broadcast. Yuakai Hamuki, your highness Roy. What crazy things are you going to do to others? You even turned off the live broadcast. Jabril, don't turn off the live broadcast. People are enjoying themselves watching it. Liu oh how, indeed, it is rare to see Asts fighting. This little girl's fighting posture is really more and more lovable. Yamamoto Genryu's I whispered, there is something wrong on my side. Arena was knocked unconscious by Conqueror's Haki, but the problem should not be serious. Yamamoto Genryu's I whispered, let me start the live broadcast. Tell me why Golden Lion and Garp haven't shown up yet. Didn't Roy say they had arrived at South Blue a long time ago? Garp and Golden Lion? Roy looked into the sky. Although Observation Haki couldn't sense it, he felt that the Golden Lion should have arrived. As for Garp, all he knew was that the old guy snuck into South Blue. Akei Ainu, who feels ashamed of not being able to intercept Roy's order, is leading a team to search everywhere. Roy. Dot 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 Roy saint. Dot please give me flowers. Rouge felt that he was inexplicably dangerous and looked at Roy carefully. Roy ignored her, but hugged Rouge and jumped up high. Ah, suddenly losing his center of gravity, Rouge subconsciously covered his stomach with one hand and hugged Roy tightly with the other hand. Bang, bang. Since he has no ability to fly, Roy can only use his strong body to imitate the moonwalk in Marine 6 styles and fly into the air, choosing an island that will not be affected by the battle. Roy Saint, seeing Roy hugging Rouge and stepping on Moonwalk to leave, Vice Admiral Ghost Spider and Huo Shashan couldn't help but exclaimed, being shocked by Roy's actions. Don't worry, Saint Roy is just going to a nearby island. I will protect him. Stussy, who had been watching Roy bully Rouge, curled his lips and jumped up high on the Moonwalk, quickly following Roy's back. Damn, Celestial Dragon. Realizing that Roy was actually going to take Rouge away, Rayleigh, who was fighting with us in the heat of the moment, couldn't help but let out an angry roar. How dare you get distracted while fighting me? Ace's eyes turned cold. She immediately caught Rayleigh's distraction, created a huge iceberg, and hit Rayleigh's chest mercilessly. Boom. There was a loud bang. Even though he covered his chest with armament haki. In advance, Rayleigh was still knocked away by this blow. The speed was so fast that several sonic boom clouds even appeared in the void. In the end, it smashed through the ice like a falling meteorite, was covered in ice and snow, and fell into the sea. Yuakai Hamuki, mighty. She is worthy of being the queen of ice. Tasakasura. Ace's sister is so handsome, Jabril, indeed, but it's still a lot worse than me. In the live broadcast room reopened by Yamamoto Genryu's Ikin, the chatting crowd once again began to watch the game with great interest. That guy really is in danger. New World, Whitebeard clenched his fists, his eyes full of worry, but there was nothing he could do. Not just because it's too far from South Blue, also because Roger didn't ask him to take care of his wife and children. Of course, if the danger Rouge encounters is not serious. For example, if he is being chased by a marine admiral, he is still willing to take the initiative to help, but thinking about the terrifying thunder that Roy continuously released that destroyed islands and countries and shocked the world, Whitebeard completely gave up the idea, not because he was afraid of Roy, but Whitebeard knew very well that his sons were not qualified to participate in this level of battle, Roy only needs to use the divine thunder that destroyed the country even once and his sons will probably suffer heavy casualties. There is no way he would sacrifice his precious sons for Roger's family. South Blue, 10,000 meters above the ground, Golden Lion snorted with disdain. One Piece is vice captain, he's just taking advantage of Roger. This guy really is far inferior to Roger and is not worthy of being compared to legends like me. On par with pirates. Ever since the Battle of Etwal many years ago, Golden Lion has looked down on Rayleigh. Not only is Rayleigh not strong enough, he is not in the same echelon as Golden Lion. Whitebeard and other legends. Because of this, Rayleigh, who was not strong enough, gained Roger's recognition and friendship. This is something even his golden lion could not get. Therefore, he had no intention of caring about Rayleigh, who was at a disadvantage in the battle with Asts. Golden Lion directly controlled the fleet flying in the air and chased in the direction of Roy. On an abandoned island, there is an empty town. Of course there were people living here before, but they had all died in a pirate robbery and massacre long ago. Ignoring Stussy who was following him not far behind. Roy carried Rouge directly into a clean small villa. What are you up to? Rouge struggled helplessly and looked at Roy with a flushed face. I'm pregnant. I know, so don't I have to take care of you? If I do something wrong, please tell me. I have never taken care of a pregnant woman. Roy smiled gently. Rouge's pupils shrank suddenly, as if he finally understood something. She subconsciously wanted to struggle, but she heard Roy say softly, Don't move around, be careful kid. Roy's tone was like a spring breeze, 
like a husband taking care of his wife. Rouge didn't feel any warmth, he just felt like he had fallen into an ice cellar. She subconsciously looked at Stussy not far away. Stussy, however, looked away in advance. Just kidding, Roy's exclusive Danxian dragon's hoof on her lower abdomen is still aching, how could she dare to interfere with Roy's business? I see. Rouge had no choice but to give up the struggle completely, lay in Roy's arms and said, if this child is a boy, he will be called Ace, if he is a girl, he will be called Anne. I like girls. If they are sons, I will strangle them to death. Roy's tone became gentler, so, how about her name be Nailona and Gong? If you like this audiobook, subscribe the channel for more videos like this. And join my Patreon if you want to support me, link in the description. Leave some comment and let me know if you guys like this story, or you have a web novel you like and want to hear its audiobook. I will be happy to create them for you. Please like, share, and leave a comment on the video.